mic test, mic test. Hello everyone and welcome back to another Buddy Bison stream. I hope we're all having a wonderful Sunday. Yes, it's Sunday today. I had to, had to reset my brain because I was like, oh no, it's Saturday. No, it's Sunday. Didn't stream on Saturday. It's streaming today. Hope we're all having a wonderful Sunday. I see that Fontano. Sorry, dropped by, although he stepped out for something apparently. Uh, today, we are going to be playing some more uh, Luminous Arc 1, which will be fun. Hopefully, uh, I have uh, re uh, re looked up the guide only to find out the chapter numbers, and there are 25 chapters. So we are about halfway through the great uh, through the game, it seems. Um, now, whether or not uh, I am actually time wise halfway through the game, I'm not exactly sure because I imagine as we get closer to the end, game gets a bit more story heavy, fights get a bit longer. Um, and that's the way I presume it will be. However, I'm not sure. So the only way I'll know is by playing it. So, uh, I mean, no real reason not to jump in right now, right? Um, but I hope everyone's having a nice day. Hope, uh, hope, uh, everyone's Saturday was nice, even though, unfortunately, I couldn't stream. Uh, went to go see the new Jujutsu Zero, uh, or Jujutsu Kaisen Zero movie. Um, it was really entertaining, really good. Uh, oh yeah, I got Paul on in my team. 
Uh, knife, bone, hell, magi robe, heat wave, hail, gale, vine. But damn. Okay. Okay, sir. You're just coming in here with th that kind of stuff. Okay, so she's level 30, 28, 25, 27, 27, 20. Okay. So, definitely want her. Definitely want her. Uh, these two are the next lowest. Uh, and then you, you. Actually, you, you. Um, yeah, okay. That, that should be good. Basically, I'm just trying to make sure... I can kind of have everyone around the same level um, in case I ever mandatorily need to use them. Reporting. Right? Like, if the game is like, hey, you gotta use this character, I don't want them to be... Okay, so we just got a whole bunch of humans. Uh, I don't want them to be shit out of luck, essentially. Okay, so we got, all, like, a whole bunch of the melee fighters um, up in the top right, so... I need to use her turn to use a skill anyway. Uh, so, might as well... Die. Uh, might as well have it go a little bit... Uh, move her a little bit over and get that uh, bump up to the next level. Okay, they're doing that. Um, I'm fine with him moving a little bit up. Uh, let's get his focus on... Because I believe tech affects accuracy, but also potentially damage on ranged enemies. Or on ranged characters. Okay, action, skill... Yeah, he doesn't... He, he All his attack... All his things are literally attacks, so he can't do anything. Which is unfortunate. Because it would be nice to be able to get him some just XP... <laughs> it would be nice to be able to get him some XP just by existing, but... Not the case. So, fire damage in an area, water damage in an area, wind in an area, earth on one target. Okay, so he has area for most, and then that one. Bonsai heals own HP by a fair amount. Okay. So, and then sword dance, a one and a two and a oops. Okay. So, already loving this manatee guy a lot. <laughs> okay. And then she is rocking... 90 XP, so I'm gonna move her up, and she can just drop an 8 over onto him. Get that 30 to level up to 26, because I do need to get her some... I need to get her some fights and some kills, because she needs XP. Um, it, I think it just so happened that most of the time when I was doing it before, it just did not line up well, where I would be doing... Uh, yeah, I'll do guard. Um, make sure that we're all not going to be taking too much damage from this. Um, it would, it just so happened that I'd be like, oh, okay, well, uh, I only need 10 XP to get to the next level, so don't give her a kill. But then after she gets the level, then she doesn't get the kill anyway. So it would just, like, kind of compound into these almost, uh, vicious cycle of I just can't get her to get the kill, unfortunately. Um, Cecile, on the other hand, is purely just, like, I'm only really using her to heal ever, so she's not getting kills. Reporting. Um, which is not great, but it is understandable. Okay, now... Ow, wow, 71. Okay. Okay, here I come. okay, so let's come in here. Actually, you know what? He has a physical attack. That is a row, if I remember correctly. A yeah, chasm. Take that. There you go. 66, 67. That's good. Probably gonna get the end. Okay, you know what? Let's move forward. So his attack is really high. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. Oh, you missed that? Okay, well, great. It's my turn. Good first impression, gotta say. Okay. One forward, or one more forward. I thought I was gonna have to, but I was hoping I wouldn't. 65, that's pretty good. 67. Uh, okay. Actually.
Potion Magic. Shine. Get her. I need to get her, I think, probably a better staff, honestly. Because that's probably what's really holding her back. Um, Skyfire. I gotta do it, so might as well put it on the one that hit, hits the most amount of people. Uh, skill. terrible because they don't really have any heals. All the heals are down here. Cecile doesn't move very quickly. She finally got a heal. Feel that's good. Um, I'm gonna move him over here to maybe try and draw the ire of some other people. He does good damage, but it's just like there, there's too many units right over here. Finally killed one of them. Reporting. Okay. Yeah, and he's probably gonna go down. Yep. Yep. Figured that. Yeah. Honestly, I might lose this. Um, which is unfortunate. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, because really wish there was just a restart button. Um, and the thing is, I don't know. I'm pretty sure I did a save state at the end of last stream, but I don't remember. And I don't want to um, go back accidentally too far. I've, I've just wasted Cecile's turns so hard. Also, it didn't help that I freaking Polon missed his first attack. He just missed a back attack. What? What is that garbage? Yeah, this is... <laughs> like, the fact that he's missed two attacks, one from the side, one from the back, it's like, what am I supposed to do? Like, there's nothing I can reasonably do other than what I have been. It's like, okay, great. Like, I, I think it's because I just haven't been checking the accuracy. Like, maybe the accuracy on him is just really, really low. Maybe? That's all I can imagine. Like, oh, for some reason he just has... Absurdly low accuracy. Yeah, Nikolai leveled up, big flash drive. Okay, attack. 
get the healer out. Yeah, what I should have done was I should have tried to concentrate all my units onto one side and then push, instead of this, like, absolutely abysmal, like, half working. Oh, he, oh, that's why. He has tech 10. His hit rate is garbage. Oh. Well, that explains it. Okay. So, I never want to use him, ever. For the sole reason that, um, he cannot really be expected to ever hit. Well, that... See, that sucks, because that's going to literally change... That, that would have changed everything about whether or not I even picked him. Ugh. And now I have to basically use Leon to clean everything up. Which is not what I wanted to do in terms of XP management. Um, we might as well keep him alive for nothing other than he can take hits. Okay, get him out. Okay, well, basically just gotta try and keep everyone else alive <laughs> while, uh, Oh, God damn it! I wanted to do aid, not aqua. I'm an idiot. Oh, great. <laughs> I am being an absolute genius in this stream right now. Ugh. See, I was wondering how far I'd be able to get in the game in, in this one stream. Uh, after, you know, making quite a bit of progress. After knowing that, oh, I only have 25 chapters I need to get through. But I think I keep forgetting that, like, I'm not inherently OP. Like, the enemies are decently strong. Right? Like, I'm not going to be able to just power my way through 1v1ing it most of the time. Like, I feel like it's... I feel like I just keep forgetting that soul fact. Like, oh yeah, I need... Usually I need one or two people to gang up on something to then be able to handily defeat it. The fact that he only has a 28% hit chance on a back attack is insane. Should be good, but god damn, this is a terrible fight. Yeah. Get yourself, can't yeah, level up. Action, flash drive, burning Leo. Okay. Just wait. There, please. Skill. Might as well try and get as much XP as I can. It's not going great anyway. Nope. Yeah, I knew Leo was going to go down. No doubt in my mind, actually. Nope. Hey, there we go. Oh. 
X slash. Oh, God. That was a terrible fight. I didn't get XP on, like, any of the people that I wanted to get XP on. Oh, that's bad. Uh, hey, Lucia, sorry about that. <laughs> I'm gonna have to be very careful with her now, because, like, her damage just isn't there. <laughs> because I, she doesn't have, like, a better staff. <laughs> uh, so I'm just gonna have to probably use her as a healer and get just levels. What? Hello, elf? What do you keep looking at me for? Do you like me or something? Are you crazy? Yeah, actually. Do you like me? Do you like me? <laughs> yeah, that's it, Elf. All this time I've just been trying to ask you out. Sheesh. I mean, come on. Aw. I was about to believe you. Okay, but at least we're going to a town. So, hopefully, that means... Do a save slot and make sure. Hopefully that means I can buy some equipment. Chapter 14, Taboo. Cool. This is the research facility! What the? This place is a mess. It seems that we are a bit late. Oh no. Help me. A light appeared suddenly. It just destroyed everything. Water. Please. I can't believe she really did this. There she is. Vanessa, you'll pay for what you did today! You killed these innocent people. Even if you are one of my lovely witches, this is horrible! No, I didn't. Shut up, no mercy! Wait, this wasn't me. This is... I'm putting an end to this. Okay, so that... So th this is actually one of the things where it's like we came upon something and apparently she didn't do it. Because I believe her. Elf, I will join your fight. Oh, this pointless destruction. It's unforgivable. Prepare yourself, Vanessa. T you too, Mavi. Uh, fine. Damn it. Um, okay, so let's return to world map. Just so I can do this. See, I tried looking up to see, like, oh, how do I make it... Like, because it seems like Turbo... Hey, Fontana. Fontana's back. See, it seems like Turbo on the DS emulator isn't like the Game Boy Advance one. Because it, like, doesn't do it as smoothly, right? Where it's like, when I was playing through Battle Network 1, I would hit fast, and it would, like... Even the sound would be faster, and it would be still, like... Legible, but if I do, like, Turbo on this... Like, it's weird. Uh, it's probably because it's a bit more of, like, a complex emulator, maybe? But I'm wondering if there's a way for me to just have it be a little bit more of, like, a smooth speed-up. Reminds me of the SNES turbo. Okay. Okay, advance the story. So, unfortunate reality is I did not get to buy any weapons, so... I'm gonna bring her so she can heal, but her magic is... Well, her magic, maybe it was just elemental? Like... Weaknesses, basically. When I was playing East 4, it would kill me because all the enemies would hit add on in a second. Ugh. Okay, so let's take you. You. I want to take him, but if you see his stats, you can look at his tech, which is the fourth one down, and it's 10. That's his accuracy. Uh, I brought him into, like, the skirmish fight, and he had, like, a 25% chance hit on a back attack, which for everyone is, like, a 100%. Um... So, yeah. Not happening. Okay. <laughs> middle, middle me! <laughs> oh, are we bringing in Zatch Bell again? Are we bringing in Ponygon? Or Umagon? <laughs> why, why are you named Ponygon? Because he's a pony, and I want him gone. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, have, I haven't tried to look it up to see what, like, online manga magazines are doing the uh, chapter. Okay. So, you know, I will... Mavi said I'll fight with you, which seems like a poor decision, given that she is Earth Element. Um, or she's Leaf Element, and the, we're fighting the Fire Witch. What is this given name? Like Horus or something? It, oh, God, it was. It, it was something... It was Schneider, I'm pretty sure. It was like Schneider. <laughs> I th yeah. like I want you to go I want you to Google that one 
But I'm pretty sure it was Schneider. <laughs> but it was some, like... Like, pretty decent, regular-esque name. Like, a, a little bit off-regular, but still, like, reasonable. Here I go. Going to Ponygon. Um, okay, so what, what What do you have? Tech up, increase tech, flex units in a small area. Okay. Uh, we're gonna move you. Action magic. That, get everyone. Yeah, with Schneider. Look at me! God damn. Look at me pulling pulling that of all things out of my memory. Man, that's gonna prove me so well in my memory. <laughs> it's gonna make my life so much better. Uh, when Ponygon was two years old, it was shown that he had a difficult time making friends with other Momato children because of his belief that his kind, the horse tribe of Momato, were slaves to the Momato tribes like the humanoid tribe. Oh god. Ugh. Yeah, dude, freaking Zatch Bell was a bit more, like, rough than you would think. <laughs> like, most people forget that. But, like, literally, literally one of the first villains that they fight is the dude with, like, the ice puppet kid. And it's literally just, yeah, my guy gets stronger through child abuse. <laughs> Gotta love classism in our Supernatural Fighter series. Basically... <laughs> But, and I remember that that was the show that taught me, like, what the meaning of the word benevolent meant. Because that was the thing that, like, Zatch took on after fighting, oh, I think it was, like, the blonde pigtailed one who, like, didn't want to fight. It was like, if there were a benevolent king, then we wouldn't have to do this. He's like, I'll be a benevolent king. I was like, oh, benevolent. That's a good word. Okay, attack. Ooh, okay. She, oh, Lord, he's coming. Okay. So I need to... I just need to make sure she gets XP. My turn, huh? I think I remember most about that series was that Zash's skills either made no sense or was a Thunderbolt. Yeah, I mean, there were some... Like, I, I do think that that was one of the neater parts about it, where not every power was an attack. And that was one of the neat things where it's like, oh, we unlocked a new power. What does it do? Because it doesn't tell them what it does. So that was always neat where it was like, there was one where it's like, it's a shield, but it's a reflector. <laughs> like, it reflects the power back. Or I think there was like an electric ball one that like curved. Are you serious? Okay, I'm not doing that. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Nope. I'm not having... I'm not having him go down in the first freaking... Not even get to actually fight. Okay, so the order you pick them totally changes. Totally changes where they show up. Interesting. That's actually good to know. Because I believe in... Uh, the... In the sequel game... It just definitively is, like, you pick where they go on the battlefield after choosing them. Uh, looks like the entire episode to figure out the magic mist on Yeah. <laughs> one mid-range iron attack, two shield that reflects. <laughs> and then there was one where it's, like, if it, like, hits, it doesn't do any damage, but it makes the next one home. <laughs> Rainbow lightning that boosts all stats, yup. Like, like, I will say, like, they did... Like, I, I, it, it was almost JoJo-esque, right? Where it's like, we're gonna have fucking mind games in this... In this, uh... In, in this battle anime, where we're like, there's gonna be thoughts that happen. For long range, I can attack five summons a dragon, yes. And like, that was the big draw, right? Where it's like, oh, well, it's the most sensible thing, where it's like, yeah, the main character is a really genius-level, smart high school student. Like... Fucking dang and Rompel level right there. Um, like, yeah, it, it, that's his thing. He's smart. He's supposed to be able to figure this kind of stuff out. Okay, I'm just gonna let these guys come down to me because obviously moving forward is not great. 
Small magnetic ball of massive energy that moves nice slow, yeah. Turn, huh? Okay, action, skill, charge. Okay. That's fine. Here I come! Here I come. Uh, so let's come over here. Magic, guard up. Let's guard you too, because I don't want you guys going. Pony God spells are all Oblivion horse armor. Yes! <laughs> all his spells are just horse armor. I remember it took him the. Like, I remember how it was, like, funny how he just did not have a. He didn't have someone to fight with him for, like, a majority of the series, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> but, I mean, I think we can all. I think we can all agree. One of the best characters, Iron Man Fulgore. <laughs> Invincible Fulgore. <laughs> the, the, the superstar loved around the world. <laughs> What is the deal for the humans, by the way? Like, why did they fight? Um... What did... I, I can't remember if they also got a wish, or it was some level of just like, yeah, you you kind of obligated. Wait, because like, I feel like it's like... It's like, oh, you're basically adopting a child. <laughs> and it's like, you don't want to just leave this child to be sad and potentially die. So I guess I'll help you. <laughs> Damn it. Okay. But yeah, I don't, I don't remember what, like... It, it, for me, it honestly... Like, all I can remember, it's like, oh yeah, no, they just, like, wanted to. There was no real, like, impetus for the human interaction other than you were chosen, Anakin. <laughs> you were the chosen one! Okay. That. Okay. Okay, I let my brother down. Okay. So let's just focus on... Wait, what's aim? Allows you to attack a distant target. That's... It's like one... It's like one out from his normal attack range. Okay, we're just gonna try and... Do this as... Sensibly as possible. We're just gonna do heals. For... From her. That way she can get the... Guaranteed 30. Um, he can move up. Get... Uh, that. Kill. That's fine. He'll get a level. Fine with Leon getting levels. He's big strong. We like to see it. Okay, action. Magic. I just need to be careful not to forget about the right side. Hopefully, I can just... Oh, wait, she'd be... Okay, she doesn't have an AoE Aqua spell. Yeah, okay, so that's the issue. Okay, I'll move her out. Oh, yeah, I forgot about the fact that Mud Eye cannot be forced to fight. Magic coercion, way too dank. <laughs> yeah, I mean, they're basically just thrown into the human world. Like, they're, n they're not given a choice. As far as I remember. So it's just like, oh yeah, no, you, you're doing it. Okay. Do that. Oh god. See, the bad part is, everyone has, like, AoEs. So, like, one attack is... Yeah, okay. Oh my god. Why are they so strong? <laughs> Why are these things so strong? Like, I don't get it. They should not be this strong. Like, they were hitting a water type with fire. It should have been doing nothing. Yeah, but the series actually makes them twice as they can. They just live like the shield girl. Yeah. <laughs> Away. 
Ugh. Yeah, you're just gonna reload. Friggin'. Okay, so I can't have everyone group up. I also cannot... I'll save there. I also cannot... Um... Uh, this is fucking annoying. Oh, what is it? These times and the inevitable cheating. <laughs> Same thing happened in the lava wacky. <laughs> okay, so someone just starts cheating. God, I love the cheaters, man. Um, really wish I could change where the people started, but it doesn't. So I think what I need to do, need to get everyone buffed, and also make sure they're all like healed up, and keep everyone not necessarily close or far away, but like within effect distance, right? Where like, okay, if something happens, I can at least get to them. But I need to take out some of these ads. Like, like... The issue is, like... Okay. I'm gonna move back this turn. Because... Because there are certain things that I am fine with, right? Like... Doing that, and then I have people clumped up. Sucks that they'll get hit, but I can at least I can at least move him away, or at least move him like to there, and then I can guard up these three, right? So that's good. And then hopefully, and then I can move her out over to here, and then hopefully this will do good damage, 105, so that's good, there's water, okay, attack, magic, heal, do that, keep them healthy, probably shouldn't have moved Mel, but that's whatever. Okay. Now move her up to there. So she can do Gale on these guys. Start working them at least. Move him out here so he can use rifle to hit that one. 86 damage, man. Their magic is very high for these, like, cop and ass summons. God damn it! Did the witches just not have high resistance? Like, this is just a tough fight. Um, like, it really just sucks. Okay. 
action, magic, heal, and just keep Leon up because like that's the this is the weird thing I will say about this game where Alf does not feel nearly as main character powerful as most JR other JRPGs would make the main character oh, feel. Right, like he doesn't he feels highly utilitary, but by no means is he OP. <laughs> In fact, he's arguably one of the more annoying characters to use because he doesn't feel strong. Like, in fact, most of... Like, he feels quite weak. It's like, oh yeah, he's got AoE here, or he's got uh, range stuff here, but his, like, physical isn't anything to write home about. And it feels like the other party members just do everything better than him. Right, where it's just like, okay, you do this good, I guess, but not amazingly. And because it's not amazing, kind of sucks. Because why am I using you? I'm like, I have, I'm pretty sure I have, like, level advantage on just about all these ads, but they're still just rocking my ass. I think that that's the thing that's really, like, annoying me, right? Where it's just like, okay, I should be doing much better than I am, but the game just says no because it doesn't give you enough towns or ease of ability to get back to said town to buy better stuff. Because I can't even remember, like, what what's the objective? Defeat all enemies. Like, so it's not even, oh yeah, just beat Vanessa. And the thing is, Vanessa's not even the issue. Like, right? Like, she has, I think she's done, what, one attack? The entire map? She's done one? Like, she's not actually the problem here. Magic. Magic. Keep them. Attempt to keep them healed, but... Yeah. Damn it. The noise of cannot be powered by friendship. Heart power. So, isn't that one thing that they specify where it's not necessarily friendship? It is just emotion, and some of them are negative emotion. You're joking, right? It's a bond, technically. Yeah. Yeah, like, I, I honestly have no idea what I can do to win this fight with the units I have. It's like, look at how many units she has at this point in the fight. With the power comes in the human, but the activation through the spell book and flows in the way. Maybe that's what I have to do? Like, I have to start using other things? Because there are items that give FP, if I remember right. Right? Like, there are items like that. Yeah, so maybe that's what I have to do. Just use some of these FP things to basically one-shot some of the ads at the start. Like, that's what I'm thinking. <laughs> Can I throw some spoilers for originals? Oh, yeah, no, I've read the entire manga. Um, and it's also quite old. 
So, if anyone is interested in watching it, or reading it, uh, please turn off. Now, what the heck about Kyo dying? Uh, which one was Kyo? Was that the pink-haired one with the shields? Because it's been a while, so I'm, I don't exactly remember all the names. Kyo was the main human. Oh, he died? Did he come back? Was that was that a thing where like he did like a? He gets like psychic. Oh, okay. I, I feel like I. I... Yeah, because wasn't that the thing with like Zatch's twin brother's main guy? Like he was also like super psychic or something. Um. See the the worst part about this is I really wish that Leon could <laughs> could solo this out, but he, he can't. If I maybe healed him, it would have worked, but I still don't think I could have. Um, yeah. Kiyomaru awakens the ability known as Answer Talker, allowing him to discern the proper course of action in any scenario, further bolstering he and Zatch's teamwork. Sorry about the caps copied. <laughs> hey, don't worry about it, man. Okay. Wait, is this... Ah, oh, fuck, I... Damn it. Oh, see, that actually really sucks, because I did the save state here. Uh, in the save file. It, okay. You know what? That just means they need to get good. And you know what? Nothing would have really changed. So, that's fine. What I need to do is just be better. Simple as that. Um... Simple. Get good. Yeah, dude, that, that's it. <laughs> um, so instead of bringing her, I'm going to bring her, because she has more health. Uh, not as much res... Uh, the resist isn't doing... Actually, uh, she's just more useful. Um, okay, so... Okay, so first and foremost, you come over to here. Your action, use a VP Fizzy on Leon, because I want him to just have the capability necessary to one-shot some bitches, because <laughs> I need that. And he's the one who probably has the best shot at it. Do this to get the level. I searched through multiple pages and I've come up with an answer. No. Bounds. Okay. Action is after I mock slash paralyzing in an arc. Um. The thing is, I. It, it, it's like everything. It, it's almost like a symmetrical dis like dispersion of enemies. So it's like even if I focused on one side or the other, they would all just go to the same area. While there are potential perks for having a Mamato partner in the human world, there is absolutely no long-term reason for helping your Mamato partner. <laughs> oh, and have I also been doing the entire fight with the fucking big screen? Oh god damn it! I need to. Come on, Bison. Like, I've looked over there so many times, but I would see the big screen, and, and I'm looking at the- Ugh, I'm a fool. Okay. Um... See, I think the main issue, right, is that... The... Here I come. The other... Uh, characters, right? They all get... Or the enemy characters, they, they're they just doing so much damage My turn, huh? that it's not even funny. Um, yeah, I'll move him forward one because I want to use charge on him. Yeah, he'll get big strong. That's perfectly fine. Because 
he's going. He's going to use guard up because I want them to all have better defense. And then Cecile should go soon. Okay, no, you win. That's fine. Magic. Aqua. Yeah, you do that. Make it so he doesn't have to use FP immediately. Wait. Uh, and you use heal on everyone. Get their health back up. Actually, no, because you're not going to move for probably a while. So I'll move you back down to the corner. And then... You pull out over here. You... Tech up him. Okay. And then just kind of keep everyone, like... Almost... I'm gonna try and just pick off the ones that maybe, like, go out too far with no support. Their range is so far, though, man. If we could work Vanessa, that would be pretty nice. And he doesn't even have to use FP. He can just whack him, because we did enough stuff. He levels. Here I come. Move her over to here to maybe drag some stuff out. Use an item to heal, because it'll be more health than any heal spell could do. Still only, like, two full attacks worth, unfortunately. Um, gonna move him here. Because I don't want everyone being super close together. For any AoEs that get procced. Looks like a T. God damn it. There's no good place to put her. Action magic. Drop a heal out over here. Get him all the way up to full. Okay. 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 Can she hit from here? Is if she can do at least some damage, it's better than nothing. 25, I'll take it. For actually, who's going next to? over here. Actually, not because I'd rather be here. Action, item, vitamint on him. Yeah, get the 285, that's fine. Yeah, figured that that was gonna happen. Yeah, Cecile's done. Which really sucks that it only takes that much. It, only, it literally only takes two hits. For Cecile to go down with her garbage amount of health because she's under level because she doesn't get any XP. <laughs> because her, she is primarily a healer. Um, I might just have to stop bringing her. Because.
because honestly like everything that she does other units do better um, so action flash drive how much would that do that do 170 and this would do 230 I'll do that because if I can get Vanessa that would be a big blow to their combat ability okay, magic heal get them up Chances are she's gonna go down. Anyway. So might as well try and have her do as much damage as feasibly possible to literally all of them. Even worth it for me to I think it's more worth it for me to use an item to try and keep um, for me to try and keep her alive than it is for me to actually attack with Alf. Okay. Are you serious? What is their fucking range, dude? <laughs> like, why are these things so absurdly far-reaching in how far they can hit? It's absolutely garbage. Ugh. And like, literally, I put her in the middle of the pack to try and get her attacked. And they just did not even come close to doing anything like that. Win, tear them up. Ugh, God. Uh, you come up here. Um, God damn, I was hoping to make a lot more progress in this game today. <laughs> And I've already been alive for an hour and have yet to clear two maps. Okay. So, that's good. has been basically used like my main character has been basically useless for this entire map which <laughs> is kind of bad not gonna lie literally can only hit himself um it's not great not a not really a great thing to be able to say Right, like, oh yeah, like, my main goddamn character has been one of the most <laughs> useless individuals in my team for this map. Just not something you ever want to be able to say. It's a very bad sentence 
to be able to say. Ugh. People are reposting things on like years ago due to uh, Persona 4. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I mean, that's the case with any time you get like a port, right? Where it's just like, oh yeah, these people that didn't know this thing are now just starting to get into a game, so now they're learning it, finally. Okay, and he's going down, that's fine. Magic, Aqua, fucking die. Level up. So I was finally able to cheat me do that. Okay. Now. Magic wind slash on you, bitch. My turn, huh? Like I feel like the issue with this map being so difficult, right? Is it's just it's almost too enclosed. Like, it's too enclosed for the amount of range that the enemies have versus the range that you have as a car as a as a player. Like these fire things, their ability to hit you is significant. With the amount of like the fact like they have such far range like they are able to move quite a distance and do good damage and that's the problem like that's a big problem come on do one okay good thank you where it's just like this it doesn't feel like the map was even built with a concept of fairness in mind. It's like, oh, we don't care if it's fair. It's just meant to be difficult. Like, almost like, I imagine it's just like, almost like an engine. Where like, okay, they have this, this, and they can just put things in. And they got to this map, and they're like, players are saying it's too easy. Just drop a couple more things in to make it seem hard. Stock commission for a broken car. Uh, okay. Uh, God damn it. Of course, you're one freaking out. Um, I gotta. Thing is, I gotta keep him up to health. Character, I'll just commission you. Okay. I mean, if the character looks good, right? Like, then that's all you really need, because it'll make a good emo. Okay, wait. Here you go. Item. Just fucking. I hate that this is how the map has ended, where it's just, I need Leon to one shot everything. Like, and the, and the annoying thing is that that's how I entered this map's mindset. I was like, okay, I'm gonna have Leon one shot the, some jobbers. But it then turned into frigging, oh yeah, he's just gonna out survive literally the entire team and get all the XP, basically. And it's, it's just absolutely infuriating. This commission back when P5R had just been announced. Oh wow, just announced, damn. Ugh. All this because we didn't even bother listening to the fucking Fire Witch because she didn't destroy the facility, apparently. <laughs> Ugh. I don't even know who I picked. What? The Wind Lepistier has calmed down. This energy must be. Is the Thunder Lepistier nearby? Did I ever tell you about my stupid response when I first saw the PA5R announcement? No, yeah, I don't think you did. <coughs> you have given us a great deal of trouble here. 
Forgive me, I have failed to control my power. Oh, hello there. You look neat. It is not that easy to forgive, Iris. You have destroyed an important facility. You're small again. Get out. Oh, yeah. Thank you. There we go. Small screen. Yeah. Uh, I, I, I keep for like keep forgetting to like look over and make sure it makes sense because on mine it's basically the DS stack screens and it just swaps them up and down <laughs> well the old facility was for you so now that we're out on here I suppose we have no more use for this facility yeah, her. whoa she has a gun <laughs> when every character other than Morgana has a gun <laughs> <laughs> I will say Kasumi's gun is cool though because it's like the it's like the uh, has like the cool reload like the the handle comes out right and you could like Winchester yeah it's like you could be like oh yeah you could see how like a gymnast would like do some fucking flip tricks to do it like the reload like Kasumi's design is goddamn spot on and I, I, like, when people theorize, like, oh, that could be, like, Fem MC for Persona 5, I was like, honestly? Like, the design doesn't, like, hit that far away from what I could see it being, right? Um, but it wasn't. She's a great character, and I don't know why. Uh, <clears throat> but if you didn't have your barrier, you would have killed me as well. You, Kingston! Hmm? Ah, you're the Witch of Immolation! You're with those traitorous garden children. What is going on here? We'd like to ask you the same thing. While well, you're at it, tell us who that little girl next to you is. Hmm, I have the strongest urge to go hug her right now. But why? <laughs> How entertaining. God must be telling me to cleanse the world of those who disobey him. Can you not throw me into another fight right now? I want to go buy some shit. Very well. I shall introduce you. Because what I'm guessing is basically at the Witch Village I got the ability to imbue stuff. However, it never let me imbue anything and there was no store to buy new weapons. <laughs> so I didn't get to do the upgrade that I'm pretty sure that that section was meant to get me to do. So I didn't get nearly as strong, which is probably why that section was so hard. Meet the Steel Witch, Iris. Steel Witch? Eh, interesting. Steel Witch? Is she like a robot? Yes. Huh? Iris is a man-made witch created through the power of rune. In a man-made witch. The result of all the work that the Round Table Council has done. <laughs> Trails of witch steel. <laughs> yep. Steel witch? What heresy! I am a little curious, though. <laughs> Although I'm not too out of it. Steel witch, spiel witch, whatever. Spiel. What an artificial witch do? I mean, it apparently destroyed this entire facility that we blamed on you. <laughs> Don't underestimate her power, or you will suffer. Suffer. Iris, exterminate everyone here. Does that include you? <laughs> I was about to say, what if she just fucking, like, nailed him to ground <laughs> immediately? It was like, okay, you were here. What? Uh, of course not! It's her. She destroyed the facility. Exterminate. Fucking executed. <laughs> Exterminate. No! Yes. That was Rune? What? It can use Rune? I mean, he did just say she was made with the power of Rune, so... Even though she was created by man, she is a witch, and witches use rune. Man, that seems really freaking heretical that you, the dude who's saying, hey, witches be bad, though, made a witch. I see. So she couldn't control her rune power, huh? Oop. And that's what destroyed this place. Indeed. Freaking... She couldn't control the power of the Lapistier. 
the weird way that this game handles like text scroll versus audio and the amount of time it lapses between auto scrolling to the next thing while they're still talking throws me off. What dost thou mean? Oh, silly me, my tongue slipped. Oh, you should go pick it up then. To tell you the truth, the thunder Le Pistier is in place of her heart. Ah, oh, well, gonna have to take that out. Thunder Le Pistier? Why does the church possess that Le Pistier? Because they took it already. Hmm, I wonder why. You're evil. The church? Did you come to my village? Did you? <laughs> the church is the one that destroyed the ninja village and orphaned her? Wow. Who'd have thought? The church in a JRPG is evil. That's enough talk. Iris, finish them. I will obey. Don't think that you can defeat me, you fake. Target acquired. Witch of immolation. Die. And I do 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 What? She's playing a song? There are monsters gathering around her! She can use monsters? Vanessa, let's settle our score later. How much trash this tin can? Yeah, sandstorm. Dude, dude, sandstorm. Fine, just this once though. Uh, you're immediately sending me into another fight? Oh, uh, no! Yeah, she only has 178 health. She's freaking garbage. Um, yeah. Uh, 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 fucking. Ah, uh, I should have done a save state. Oh, well. Just gotta get good, I guess. Okay. So what do you do? What is your thing? Guard up, tech down. Guard, okay. So you know what? Guard up, immediately a good thing to do. Um, hey, give everyone big D. And then move up here, because you got guard up. Maybe take some hits. 93. You wanna play? Okay. Uh, let's check to see elements typing. Electric. Electric. Yeah, it makes sense. Okay, because they're all... Dude, she's the... She has Thunder Lepistia, so it makes sense. I don't know what's good against Thunder. I presume Earth is good against Thunder. Fire's probably neutral. Uh, attack up, guard down, heat wave, seduce. 105. Okay. You know, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna let them come. And instead, I'm gonna use attack up on her and Alf. Because Alf needs it, because Alf is <laughs> kinda bad. <laughs> As I was oh eloquently saying uh, last time. Um, okay, we're gonna try and work together and take us to these flipping shipwrecks. Hopefully, honestly, this one should be a tad better because I have the high ground, so that means my attacks won't get like messed up by like the not being able to go up enough, hopefully. Eighty level up. So Twenty-nine. Okay, you come over here. Your magic is a hundred, so you might be able to do something. Fifty-seven. Um, but you know what? I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna keep her. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use heals because one gets her a level, perfectly fine. Gotta swap the screen again. Remember it this time. Here I come. Um. Okay, I actually need to check what uh, what 
what it what is boosted? Your attack is boosted, your guard is boosted, your guard is boosted. Okay. So let's come over here and let's use speed boost. Can't remember if speed boost makes their turns come faster or if it's just like an evasion scenario. Okay. So I got a healer over here. I think can't remember if she can heal guy. Healer over there, so I'm gonna and move her over here. Let's see your best. Also helps that most of these people seem like they're going to be... Uh, ...seem like they're going to be melee attackers. Yeah, her attack is not nearly as high as I would have liked it to be. Oh, well. Whoa. Not sure if it's real or not. Didn't, uh, oh, did you hear about the Elder? Yeah, I did hear about it. Um, where it's like the illusory wall that takes 50 hits to go away. Uh, I was talking to my friend about it yesterday after the movie. And honestly, it really just seems like a carryover. Like, almost like a bug. Um, because if you watch the video, the wall just disappears with no animation. Like... Like... Basically, I think what it was, and a lot of people have theorized, it's it was supposed to be an illusory wall, but they decided not to because it just leads to an area it's, that you know you've already been to. Um, so what they did instead of just replacing it with an actual wall, because that probably would have been like annoying programming, they just changed the health value on the illusory wall higher. It seems. Yeah. Yeah, because, like, illusory walls, they only take one hit. I think they... You wanna play? I think it's just made so it's, like, one hit is enough to do the necessary damage. Um, okay, so that's 138 on hit. What's her... What's that? That's 105. Okay, so we're just gonna... We're just gonna slash it. Now he can come in. Two big two big hitters coming in. Having some fun. See, waste of XP, because he's at 86. And this kill is probably gonna give him like 30 or something. 42. But I don't care. <laughs> I don't care if this is inefficient spread of XP. I just need to win this fight. That's it. But yeah, like having the upper, the high ground really makes it a lot easier to just deal with this because like th they're like they have to get funneled. <laughs> but the previous one on this map, I had to go up the stairs to attack or they would come down, but they had a lot more AOE options than I did. <laughs> so it was just kind of bullshit for me. Whereas in this case, it's a bit more even because they seem to only have melee. Um, much more agreeable, I would say, in, uh, in the long run. Um, don't even know if you even need heals, but I'll do it. You move over here, action, magic. Put the guard on you too. Can you heal yourself or no, you can just do guard up, protect it, huh? Okay. 40, so that's fine. Because I'll just have Lucia healer. 105, 109, that's good. You just stay at the lip right there, that way. You know, nothing can happen. Block, block off the ways that they can come up. Uh, heal. Because also having the high ground makes Theo a lot more useful. Because he can just use his bow and tag people. I mean, if I didn't move him too close to the edge. Okay, 
action. How much does your attack do? 84. He has 151 health. That's far too much attack. He is... Health is so weak. Like, his attack is boosted, but I just, like, need a new sword for him or something. Okay. Oh, you wanna play? Okay. These two are like an absolute unit together where things are not gonna survive them both attacking. No problem. Which is what we need and want. Okay, that's fine. That's also fine. A little less fine, but still fine in general. Because I can just have her come down and Heal them. Keep them all nice and healthy. You have 58. How much health do you have? You have 62 health. Okay, you... How much XP do you have? You have 72. Okay, so if you kill, you'll level and get full HP. So that's not a... That's not a worry. her over, like, one. Pop the heal on both of them. Get them good. Do that, get him. Good. Okay, here I come. He can come over here. And... Hey, Dodo, how's it going? Nice to meet your strategy, goodness. Yes, it is. Uh, oh, sweet, he only has to do a regular attack. Just level up, gets all his health back. Good. My turn, huh? Okay. Um. You know what? I'm gonna. I'm gonna let her come up one more square because I oh, want to be able to kind of like sandwich her. that she can move. Guard down. Yeah, can't see based on that. How are you doing, Dodo? Hope you're doing well. Hope you're having a grand old time. I feel like I haven't talked to you in a while. So, I want to catch up. Playing any uh, good games right now? Ugh. And have you ever played Luminous Arc before? Or no will problem. this be a... Uh, a new thing. Okay, so she's using FP on her. I think it's not one shot, I'm fine. 149, that's perfectly alright. But she is paralyzed, which is unfortunate. Okay, didn't realize. Okay. Gonna have to be careful. Okay, action, FP, Magnum Fist. Can't do that. Punch him really hard. Kill one, get a level. There you go, level 31. That's what we like to see. Move one up so we can move closer. It's my turn! Uh, I'm gonna move him over here so he can do first aid on her. Make sure that she at least has a bit more health. Action, flash drive, mock blade. God, even with that, doesn't do enough to kill. Like his 2 FP move. Next. Oh. What can you expect? Um. Honestly, I'll just do this. Her. I'm just gonna heal with her. Uh, you know, I think it's sleep apnea, otherwise doing good. Play Trails of the Third and a little Wild Arms 4. Not familiar with this one. Okay. Nice. Yeah, I've never played any of the Wild Arms games, but I've heard they're good. Um, okay, so how do I do this? I can do this. Yeah, let's do that 268. It's worth it. 
Yeah, I've only... So this is... Uh, I should tell you. This is my first time ever playing this game. Um, I've played the sequel game, uh, but never the... Uh, uh, but never the first one. <laughs> okay, cool. There we go. Good, good level. Oh, but it is nice playing a game where leveling up just heals you. <laughs> I feel like not enough games do that anymore. It's like, oh yeah, you timed your level really well. Here you go. Okay, I'll get, let her get the kill so she can level up 30. Okay, good, good, good. This one, a lot better. So, you, you missed the first time I... Bait. So basically this is like the second in two. Like, I did one fight and then I was forced into a second one immediately after. This is the second fight. The first fight took me three or four tries due to the annoyance where basically I was fighting this girl, the one my cursor's over, she's a fire witch. And she was up here and my unit started down here. Um, and that one was much harder because her units had a lot of AoE. Um, and decent movement as well, so they were able to just, like, ream the shit out of me. But now, this one, a lot easier. Uh, action. Queen Blade. What is this one? Yeah, but he has high resist, so... Not even high resist, only 73. Cool. But yeah, everything you do, other than waiting, gives you XP, however slight. Buffing yourself gives you 5. Buffing or healing someone else gives you 30. Um, and killing an enemy and damage enemy uh, changes how much you get based on the level of the enemy that you're doing it to. So, uh, the most uh, standard, or I don't want, want to say standard, but the most consistent way of getting XP is to quite literally be like, okay, can you heal someone? Or can you, like, do something to another character right now? Um, and one thing that I think I mentioned, but you may not have been here when I did, um was I mentioned, like, waste of XP. So basically, um, when you level up, the XP doesn't roll over. Um, so if you're at 99 XP and you kill a guy and get 50, okay, you're wasting 49 XP because you just get to the next level and you're at zero. So sometimes it's actually better to not take a kill. Like, you'll be at, like... 4 XP, and it's like, okay, instead of killing this guy with this character, I'm gonna have this character use a self-buff, level up, and let someone else take the kill. Someone who can make full use of the XP. Uh, compliment font with Olivier Lenheim persona? <laughs> hey, Max, how's it going? Um, okay. <laughs> My dear Fontano, how do you do? Your voice is so sultry today, might I take you down to the local bar where we could get inebriated? We don't have to tell Shara why now, do we? I <laughs> uh, don't know when I'll get it, but I just got Shenmue 1 and 2 for 6 bucks on PS5. Awesome. <laughs> Uh, that's the first time someone has redeemed that <laughs> since I've made it a thing, I think. But yeah, so like this, in this situation, uh, Dodo, where Theo has 96 XP. So if he does anything, it would be a waste other than using a self buff that will give him 5 and level him up to 31 guaranteed. Whereas she's only at 10 XP, so... She's the highest level unit I have, but um, I'm not sure he would be able to get to the unit prior, and I just want to end this fight because I'm pretty sure I don't have as strong equipment as I need to have right now, <laughs> so things are a bit tougher than they probably should be. But how are you doing, Mannix? Hope you're doing well. Okay. 
battle result. And another thing that's interesting uh, in this game is you can basically do after combat, like, relationship building conversations with all the characters. Um, and the heart symbol is basically how close are you to having a max relationship with them. Um, so I'll just do this one because uh, she just joined my party and I need to remember to swap the DS screen. Uh, good. Did some volunteering uh, all weekend. Nice. That's good. <laughs> uh, what did what did I do this weekend? Uh, I certainly didn't volunteer. Yesterday I went and saw the new Jujutsu Kaisen movie. Really good. Enjoyed it. Uh, and then got uh, well. Prior to that, went out for lunch with my friend because we went to go see it together. And Fontano worked. Uh, and then after the movie, we went to the Cheesecake Factory to get some slices of cheesecake. Um, and it's over in my fridge right now because I didn't have it yesterday. Uh, just waking up letters, or just waking up letters are traveling. Is that allowed? Yes, it is. Totally allowed. Because last night I gang cheesecake at the cheesecake round. Ah, oh, yeah. No, it's totally allowed. <laughs> Although the first thing I ever got at the Cheesecake Factory, I remember, was like this big, big ass brownie boat with me and my brother. Too many typos. <laughs> <laughs> I see you children are no strangers to combat. I risk activate your hyper mode. Oh, was this freaking Aegis from Persona Q? Hyper mode initiated. Exterminate all of the witches, garden children, and any surviving researchers who are still here. Cheesecake yummy, yeah. Oh, keep protecting me with your barrier, of course. Energy at 100%. Yo. Disengaging limiter. Energy at 110%. Oh, shit. So much power! <laughs> if we stay here, we'll be vaporized. <laughs> These hyper modes never require a 20 character security code. So unrealistic. <laughs> you know, that's true. Where's her numpad? Releasing power in five, four. T everyone, get over here. Now help me out. Oh, you know where it is. <laughs> Chest opening. <laughs> uh. God, I, f I, I feel like I remember watching an anime where there was like an android maid, and of course, like the buttons were the nips. <laughs> And I cannot for the life of me remember it because I was way too young. <laughs> like, because this was back in the day where you could find, like, episodes of anime on YouTube. But it would be, like, sliced into, like, episode 5, 1 third, 2 third, 3 third. To get around, like, the minute limit. <laughs> or something. Like, it was way back in that day where that was the way to... <laughs> one of the primary ways to watch anime. Um... Like, oh god, can't remember it though. Uh, gotcha! Three, two... Everyone, run to Vanessa! Jump into a massive bosom with the star on it! One, zero! <laughs> Had to say it in word instead of number. <laughs> Time for Solar Flare! <laughs> the glory days, yeah. <gasps> Where are we? You're near the town of Madrasta. Mel and I t teleported us here. We jumped all the way to the next town over, huh? Thanks for your help, Vanessa and Mel. I couldn't have just watched you guys burn. I have to thank you, too. Thank you. Oh, were you guys there, too? I didn't notice. Well, then, I've got my own stuff to do. See ya. She explodes so hard it regenerated the landscape a la RVB rules. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> oh, you camping bitch! It's a legitimate strategy. <laughs> Wait, Vanessa! Aw, oh, she's already gone. Bitch, I, I, I asked to have a heart to heart with you. What the hell? Vanessa, she's acting cocky, but she really. Vanessa. I would classify that steel witch as a major threat. Oh, really? Even Vanessa ran away from her. They were seriously trying to kill us. Oh my god. Who'd have thought? <laughs> I guess that means we're no longer welcome in the church. I mean, you could have presumed presume that after you beat back 
looked freaking Dick Helmet Man and a uh, freaking Archbishop. <laughs> like, come on, man. <clears throat> I can't believe the church created such an abomination. Oh no. You have to keep your eyes open to seek the truth, Missy. The but church is evil. Close my eyes to pray? No. If you have your eyes open, you can see what's happening in front of you. Like evil church? You're not alone, Cecile. We won't let what we see scare us. Probably. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> and, you know, we won't let scare us. <laughs> but we're still run away, but not fearfully. <laughs> hey, it's, it seems like something's going on in the town. Let's go check it out. Let me buy some stuff. Okay, so I totally still get the intermission. <laughs> You're stronger than I thought. That makes you strong for a human. But nothing compared to me. <laughs> Bring it on! Someone's always stronger. Don't be too confident. Bring it on! <laughs> you got some fire to you, kid. I respect you for that. Takes some real guts to stand up to the witch of immolation. Yeah, you got you gotta match the fire. You gotta match the intensity. This ain't the Sundaray route. <laughs> That's Lucia. <laughs> Let me give you something nice. Close your eyes. Wink. You have obtained Esther. Life of Coffin! I've become friends with the radish that Lady Vanessa introduced to me. His name is Daikon. I invited him to my favorite bucket. We talked about a number of things. He said, one doesn't need a reason to live. Just existing is good enough. Dude, that radish. That radish has some life lessons. Okay, let's, uh, let's save after all that shenanigans. And let's also save state after all that shenanigans. Um... Yeah, that's... I can never want to do that all again. Um, equipment. Do I have anything? Okay, firing, reduce... Man, that sure would have been great to have. I don't know when I got that ring. I hope... I hope it was after the firefight. So I don't feel like an absolute lunatic to not have that on. Um... Oh, and you can totally de-equip stuff. Uh, I'm taking his stuff off because I want to see if I can put it on other people. Yeah, give me that. Uh, what else did I take off of him? Did I... Guard... So there are only two people that can wear it. Um, honestly, Cecile is kind of dead to me at this point. Because she's like far too low. She dies way too quickly. Uh, what the hell deep cut is this? In Trail of Steel 4, Le uh, Leaf is indirectly mentioned during a conversation between Nisa Eager and Albert Vaughn. While Tyrion is on the Pentagon where it's revealed that she is an old friend. Wait, Lif? Who would notice a reference to Kosuke Kisuke? <laughs> okay, wow. I mean, apparently, some people do. See, I will say, I'm not a big fan of mobile games and, like, the gotcha games and stuff. Uh, hashtag someone who did a sponsored <laughs> stream for, uh, <laughs> for Raid Shadow Legends. But, uh, if, like, out of all the ones that I kind of wish would come <laughs> to the West... That is one where, like, I would be fine with that because I would probably play that one. <laughs> Purely for the sake, because it's trails. Uh, yeah, and everything is weaker here. <laughs> right, like, that would be the only reason why I would even think to play it. Okay, I have 11 vitamins. Okay. Uh, I only have one of uh, these, so let's buy a couple more. Okay. So let's go back up and hopefully this town lets me buy some better equipment. Chapter 15, Parting Ways. And there are 25 chapters in this game, so I think I was rightfully to say that I was not halfway through 
given time-wise, in that I've been streaming this for an hour 41 to get through that one chapter. <laughs> Did you see that flash of light? The entire town was destroyed instantly! I'm sure that light was caused by a witch's magic. Scary. Well, I guess you're right. <laughs> a man-made witch, though. This town will probably be next. I'd better start running! No matter where you try to escape to, the witches will eventually get us. Everyone seems to be in a panic. They're all afraid of the witches. Of course they are. The facility at Judaeth was blown up. That was the Steel Witch, though. It wasn't us. <laughs> There's no point in trying to convince them of that. I wonder why the church created the Steel Witch. I suspect that they're trying to fight fire with fire. So you think that they created the Steel Witch to defeat the other witches? Indeed, but I must stress that I was just using a figure of speech. I'm not saying that all my beloved witches use fire. Hmm, he seems to know his onions. They must have learned their lesson when they sent that whole group and niced up against Vanessa. You think the church is that desperate to get rid of the witches? And they progressed their research that quickly? <laughs> I figure they don't want us trying to keep their god from waking up. They don't even know that it's connected to the end of humanity. That battle with the Steel Witch was tough. Let's take a break. Although the fight against Vanessa was tougher. I want to eat a big egg frittata. It's a frittata. I wouldn't mind checking out some of the local scenery. Wink. <laughs> Wink. <laughs> Imagine a quiche. Okay. Now remove the crust. Hmm. But that's like one of the best parts about a quiche. And add ingredients. Okay. <laughs> but remove the dairy. <laughs> oh god. Too many, too many, too many removes and adds. Can't keep it together. Let's stick together for now. Try not to let anyone see Pole on. Yes, sir. Oh, shop, yeah. <laughs> shop. Let me buy. Rapier. Okay, yeah, you're buying that. Um, yep, you're getting that. Yeah, see, I don't even care if it. I don't care how much better it is. It just needs to be slightly better. Yeah, I can. Don't need to waste time on that. Um, Chizuru, probably not going to be using you necessarily all that much. Um, honestly, I use you. I don't even use you to attack. I don't need to buff you. Uh, let's get you that boost. Um, um, let's get you that silver lamp. Oh, that's neat. Um. Cestus, take that. It's an Italian egg pie with no crust. Ah, okay. Messer, okay. So I can not worry about those, so... Let's equip everyone's weapons. Attack 40 to 90. Look at that jump! <laughs> like, 50 to 5 to 8. Like, Jesus Christmas, dude. Okay, so this is like pure... Okay, so no more magic for him. That's not going to be really like a way to go. But, I actually might buy Fuka's. I might go back and buy Fuka's. Um, 30. Yeah, that one's a pretty big jump. There we go. Yeah, for everyone else, it's not really big improvements. Um, okay, yeah, let's buy, let's buy Fuka's. Because that's a pretty significant one. And we got you. Once again, really wish I could see how much the thing I have on now does. Because that's that's really the big thing. Like, how much better is it? Buy two of that. Tonks Chum. Eh. Okay, so I can buy some more of these. Do that. Just do not want to be caught with my, uh... Pants oh yeah, there are, I have holy feathers. I forget that that's an item as well. Okay, so let's come over here. Here. Fuka, there we go. And then you... Okay, 
so you're 35, 30. Okay, 35, 30 for the defense. Yeah, big, heavy plate improvement. There we go. So, happen. Yeah, just sell all these because I'm never going to use them again. Thirty-five and thirty. So that's. I'll buy one and put it on Leon. Um. Then I'll buy one for Theo. Then I'll buy two of these: one for Mel, one for Lucia. Two cell codes, one for Mel, one for Lucia. Okay, so no more weapons. Uh, I want him to get that. And he can get that. You can get the frog hood. Frog hood. Uh, not sure if I can use Chloe from Koski for emotes, much I guess she looks very similar to Erica. Ah, uh, okay. I mean, the one that shouts out to me for good emotes would probably be Shizuna, right? She, like, like I don't even know her character, but I, I like her appearance. <laughs> Like out of all the out of all the characters that I've just seen, I'm like, she is not she looks cool. <laughs> she is from Kuro, but yes, I was thinking Agnes. Agnes is also really like her her design is also pretty recognizable. Alright, go ahead. Um, okay. Okay, so I think I have everything on except maybe one of the hoods. that on. Yeah, okay. No, that's on. So, those are both worse. Yeah, those are all worse. Anyone? Oh, wait, no. Okay. Silk coat. Yeah, going from 28 to 50 defense. That's good. That'll help survive quite a bit. Um, uh, 25, yeah, that's perfectly fine. Okay, so now time to go sell all of the stuff so it doesn't fill up my inventory. And so I can recoup some of my costs. Okay, so this game does not have a system where you hit left and it maxes it out. When you need to sell it, you actually have to go right over to the amount. I'm trying to pull a trails, <laughs> where you just like shoot it to the left and it maxes out however much you have or however much you can buy. Um, okay, so all that's good. Save state there, return to the world map, do an actual save. There we go. Just to make sure, because I don't want to have to do all that again. Okay. So we got Speak with Mavi, Speak with Saki, Labrador. How arrogant can humans be? Did they really think that they could control that much power? Unlimited power! Least favorite lack of quality of life when you are allowed to select more items than you can afford. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, you don't have enough money. And it's like, cool, then why'd you let me pick it? And one quality of life thing that I will say is annoying when you don't want to be active, but is nice is, uh, are you sure you want to buy this many items? <laughs> um, that is, of course, unless selling an item gets you as much money as it takes to purchase it, at which point then I'm fine with that, like that not being the case. 
Or in, I guess Borderlands does it where it's like if you sell the gun, you can buy it back immediately. If you, like, if it was an accident. Uh, I, I'm not sure about the exchange rate of it, but, um, like, systems like that where it's like, oh, maybe you didn't mean to sell it so you can buy it back, or even if you did sell it, it's not impossible to just buy it back and not lose any money on it. I can't forgive him for fooling with the Thunder Lapistia like that! I can't understand how that kind of person can believe in God's justice. God's justice! The Steel Witch, Kingston, is playing with innocent lives. The Grand Cardinal's behind this, I'm sure. I wonder what his goal is. You'd think he has enough power. I mean, he leads the church and everything. Well, he's obviously after more power than he can get by leading a religion. He also doesn't seem to have a problem with sacrificing the people who serve the church. Uh, I'm trying to think of, like, other good quality of life changes. Right? Like, like they're just, like, noticeably made. Like, I think one that I like uh, in Elden Ring, you can put down a marker, like a blue pillar of light, and like, you'll see it. And then when you run through that pillar of light, it disappears. Like, it comes off your map. That way you don't have to, like, get there, go into your map, take it off, and then go back into the game. Uh, wait, are we blaming the kid, or am I getting the characters confused? Uh, they're assuming that the leader of the church is behind it. I believe, as far as I can tell. Because uh, I think the Johannes is the Grand Cardinal. Yeah, Breath of the Wild. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a good quality of life feature for any, like, open world S game. And just having it be a massive pillar of light is really nice instead of it just being like a little thing on your compass at the top. Uh, one quality of life thing that I've never really thought of as quality of life, but I guess it is, is being able to, like, with the minimap, have it be fixed rotation or not fixed. Because I, like, if it's not fixed, I want the option to fix it. <laughs> I always made the habit of getting somewhere tall and spinning around for shrines. Yeah. Get to somewhere tall, spin, see if you see them, mark it, mark it, mark it. <laughs> yeah, it, like, it's still one of those things where, like, when it's not fixed, how am I supposed to know what direction I'm going if the mini-map is also spinning? <laughs> like, if I open the map and I say, I need to go down, and then I hold down on my control stick, and it flips the map over so I was actually heading up. <laughs> like, what's the point? Like, fix that mini-map and make it... Because all my mindsets are for runs now. Yeah. Uh, yo, can someone mod Trails of Cold Steel 2 to just have the mini-map be bigger in the top right-hand corner? <laughs> to, like, show more of the map? <laughs> Please. Because <laughs> that mini-map, useful, it's nice, but when you're in, like, a shrine... <sighs> yeah, Megami Tensei 1 does that spinning, it's annoying. Yeah. <laughs> True. Is this what their god wants, too? I don't know. Speak with Saki! Not Sake. Not the alcohol. The Thunder Lapistier. My clan. Everyone. Saki? I've told you that I was from the Shadow Clan, correct? And now. I'm the only surviving member of my clan. The Thunder Lapistier belong to the Shadow Clan. What? Are you saying that? The Shadow Clan was slaughtered and the Thunder Lapistier was stolen. Kingston had the Thunder Lapistier. He was the one that stole it. Time to murder him. Kingston stole the Thunder Lapistier? So that's the reason why the Shadow Clan was destroyed. I've been tricked by the Church for my entire life. <sighs> I'm a fool. How can I trust my intel? Saki, don't be so angry with yourself. I was working for my enemy. What would I say to my clan if they were alive? Yeah, I think they'd be angry too. Lucia, you didn't have to say that. But they wouldn't be angry with you, Saki. They'd be angry with the church that had you believing their lies all this time. <laughs> Let me say the thing that would depress you, but then flip it on its head. So it doesn't depress you. <gasps> I'm sure of it. 
Don't hate yourself over this. I see. Thank you. I know what I must do now. I'm the only one left who can guide the anger of my dead clan now. Okay, Liberty time. Life of the Lion King. Lion King, Lion King, we're gonna find the Lion King and shoot him and mount him on my wall. What? <laughs> uh. Hey, it's the Life of the Lion King. I used to read this all the time when I was little. It was once a great knight in the West. No one could match his skill with the sword, his bravery, or his honesty. What the hell is that? Freaking rainbow lion? Damn, okay. Just... <laughs> the people called him Lion King as a sign of respect. He used his sword, the Regulus Heart, which is a pretty good sword name, to condemn many evil sinners. He devoted himself to the Luminous Church and therefore was not really great, and fought for the safety and happiness of its people. However, when the holy capital of San Reis was attacked by pirates, the Lion King lost his life to the pirate's sneak attack and died protecting the holy capital and the church. Let's break the flow of combat and suspense to spend time in the library. I mean, you know, it's fine. We need to get the lore! <laughs> you say that as people, as a good chunk of the people watching this have probably played, know of, or watched <laughs> frigging trails <laughs> where... It's not exactly strange to just be like, okay, guys, we did just pick up a new Gambler Jack. I gotta read this. <laughs> I know, I know that we're trying to infiltrate this top secret military base that's bringing, running with people that want to murder us, but I just got the next volume and now I need to read it. <laughs> you know about my past Yagazi, yup. <laughs> His loss was mourned by a great many people. Steel Witch R&D record too, because this is just in the library here. Development of the Steel Witch. We have succeeded in introducing the Thunder the Pistier into the heart of Subject Beta 13. Just that 30 minutes of cutscene, that means we're due for 30 more minutes of cutscene. <laughs> yup. We have confirmed that the organism and the rune have become linked. We then proceeded to take steps to release the rune that accumulated within the subject's heart. However, an a problem was detected where the output was becoming unstable when the subject's emotions were affecting the energy from the Lepistier. In order to resolve this problem, we installed an emotion control unit inside her head so that we could control her emotional variants. Also, Beta 13's memories were deleted due to the possibility of outside interference inhibiting the energy processing. Furthermore, part of Beta 13's body was damaged during the experiment. Replacement parts have been installed according to the organic fusion theory. So is this, was this a person? Did, did they take a human? Fucking put the Thunder Lapistier in their chest? Like, is it not actually, like, a robot? We've confirmed that the artificial parts have enhanced the output of rune energy due to the parts' increased absorption capabilities. Gunslinger with magic. Mm. This may prove that there is definitive difference between the bodies of humans and those of witches who can store and release rune energy seemingly at will. The Pistier fusion process will likely be a fruitful research topic. Dreamers! Fighting dreamers! Na, 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 na. That Naruto opening? God, that was a weird series. Yeah, finish reading it. <laughs> uh, this is one of those round table council research labs, huh? The original Barilla manuscript was stored in the town of scriptures and bedrasted for generations. Many people have prophetic dreams in this city, okay? These dreams make God's presence even more evident. The dreamers have recently begun to discuss their dreams with each other and are working to find out what their dreams all have in common. They all claim to have seen a ruined altar surrounded by trees in the moonlight. Have I ever heard? I feel like I've heard of it. I feel like I've heard of it. I, uh, I, ah, shit, yeah, I feel like, I feel like I have heard of it. Can you give me, like, a short plot synopsis of, like, the first bit of it? Because <laughs> that, because I could probably tell you if I have definitely seen or read it or watched a little bit of it at some point, if I had that. In the moonlight. It is thought that this is a vision of the altar of souls used in a ceremony mentioned in the Barilla manuscript. This is the holy eclipse, which is performed to initiate God's resurrection. We have reports from several dreamers and believe we have located this altar. So Johannes has also begun to speak about the dreams he has been having. Basically, a welfare agency in Italy is a front for counterterrorism using abused and orphan girls as cybernetically altar soldiers. Uh, no. No. I Then definitely not. I was thinking of a western. 
I was thinking of like a I think maybe like a fantasy western show. <laughs> so definitely definitely have not seen that. <laughs> his dreamers corro his dreams corroborate the other dreams, and he believes that he is being guided to where he will need to be for the holy eclipse ceremony. Nope, child agents. Lovely. All that remains is to collect the materials necessary for the ceremony. This is all for the glory of God, who will be with us quite soon. Love it. Glory to God! Fuck off! Okay, let's advance the story. Hey everyone, the Cronites have come! Yuck, now Heath is with them! Oh fuck, we're gonna have to fight Heath now. Now this town will be safe! Hey, cheers for Sir Heath! I wanna fuck him! Hip hip hooray! What? Sir Heath? Oh, it's him! Brother, it's Sir Heath! Hey, let's go say hello! Fucking idiots. <laughs> Goddamn. Absolute idiots. Hey, you remember this dude who's super devout to the church? And is totally still, like, with them? Let's go say hi after we have literally den pro been denounced. Their emotions were controlled by drugs and such, but they had to have some level of humanity or they would, like, die or at least not function optimally. Like, mm. Wait, we've been branded traitors. Yes, thank you, Cecile. If we are captured, we will likely be executed. I'm sure Sir Heath will believe us. <laughs> Those ellipses beg to differ. But there are too many people there now. Let's wait until he's alone. Sir Heath! Hooray, hooray! Everyone, please calm down. We have come to investigate the reason behind Judith's destruction. Witches did that, right? I am here to determine that for myself. Will this town be safe? Yes, the Crow Knights will protect the people of this town. Please, pay no heed to any rumors that are being spread. About Judaeth and the witches. This guy gives me Arthur vibes. Does his right arm work? <laughs> uh, probably. I think it works. Because he uses a lance, and I think he's right-handed, honestly. <laughs> the witches want us to panic and act out of fear. If you say so, Sir Heath. I, 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 I'm not going to act out of fear, but you want to come back to my place? Watch out for him summoning God. Love it. <laughs> uh. Back to work, everybody! Please, Sir Heath, please bring back peace to our town. Sir Heath, we are prepared to leave. Allow everyone to take a small rest. After that, we will leave for Judaeth. Yes, sir. Time to slice some throats. Time to go Assassin's Creed on this bitch. Sir Heath! Sir Heath? That worker reminds me of a small plot point in Vesperia. <laughs> you! What do you want, traitors? Eh. You have ignored your mission and allowed yourself to be charmed by the witches you were sent to condemn. You have also attacked Sir Andre. No, we weren't charmed. Lucia and the other witches helped Theo. Did you ask the witches to help you, knowing that they were against our god? Wait, Sir Heath, the church was going to use Theo as an experiment. Are you saying we should still have faith in the church after that? Jadith, okay. They were building a tower under the promise that the workers would gain nobility, but somehow no one knew how nobility works. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> if anything, usually it's like, oh, we're gonna have the people build the castle, and then we're gonna kill all the people that built the castle because they know all the secret ways to get into it. <laughs> the exact opposite of nobility. They need an emperor to grant nobility, and they don't have one during the game. <laughs> oh, great. Church created the Steel Witch in Jadeth. A Steel Witch? Yeah. Jadeth was leveled because the Steel Witch lost control. These lovely witches would never do such things. They are all kind people. Kind people. Then how do you explain the actions of the Witch of Immolation? Well, she's not one of these witches. <laughs> Heath. <laughs> all these people. All the... Oh, yeah. Speaking of Steel Seer... Uh... Steel series. 
Hang on, I'm right there. Steel Series headphones. It's it's in, it's interesting where like, once I got like a full time job and like got money, I was like, you know what? I will I will. <laughs> I I I will spend a bit mo a bit of money to get like good headphones. <laughs> not that I'm like one. I'm not like visually and auditorily. I'm not one of those like oh yeah I need like super high resolution pixels or like the best I can I can hear things so cleanly and smooth. Like I, I my senses aren't good enough for that to be able to differentiate. But these are just comfortable and I like them and they have all like the good functionality and stuff. So it. But, like, I remember when I was, like, in high school, it was just like, okay, what are the cheapest over-the-ear headphones I can buy? Audio picks. Well, I was talking about, like, monitors, like, where, like, I want a good monitor, but I don't need, like, a friggin' 240 hertz, 4K, curved monitor. <laughs> like, those kind of things. Um, but yeah, like, statistically, we're all nice people. Because <laughs> the Witch of Immolation is not here. You know, headphones might have an issue where you have to wiggle it to get both channels or... Ah, okay. Well, I think I have the... I have one... I have a Steel Series. They're pretty good. I like them. Um, I think, I think the next ones I get will probably be, like, the next ones up. That I think the, think the idea... Because, like, the nice part about the Steel Series is they have, like, a dedicated dongle to put into, like, the, the USB-C port of something. And it also comes with a USB... Uh, a regular USB adapter for it um, and because it's a dedicated one it doesn't get like it doesn't get like messed up because it would have to connect to the same thing other Bluetooth devices have to connect to so it's honestly nice um, but yeah I think the next time next one I want to get like going like upgrading would be one that's able to connect to like two Bluetooth devices at the same time that way, if I'm ever, like, playing my PS5, I could also have it connected to my PC, and that way I could still, like, listen to things, uh, like, videos if I were ever playing my PS5. So my speakers create a very minor high-pitched noise when plugged in. Lovely. <laughs> she single-handedly wiped out the Eurus knife. Yeah, she's not here, bitch. I apologize for what Vanessa has done. Can't hear when it's plugged in or out of my room, but it's there. Okay. I like how no one thought to counter with Vanessa's not here. <laughs> I have seen many people who have suffered from the witches. Oh yeah? I will really? never forgive the witches for what they have done. <laughs> let me let me deliver this line, enunciating every word <laughs> with just the barest amount of emotion. <laughs> It's like, like, I'm curious, what has he seen? Because we've seen most of the witches that exist right now. <laughs> what things in his past that got associated with witches other than Vanessa doing the Eurus Knight, uh, like, Annihilation? Can, is he so gung-ho about killing witches? <laughs> One time a witch stole his lunch money. Honestly? I swear to God that I will see all witches punished for their crime. Well, yeah, but what if the witches didn't do crimes? None of the witches in our party have done crimes. <laughs> so, they need not be punished. Or is their crime existing? Sir Heath, the witches aren't our enemies. Silence out. Not another word. Are you going to say that the enemy is the church? Or God himself, perhaps? What? <laughs> I mean, who says there has to be an enemy of, like, like, why, why does an entire race of people have to be an enemy, or why does an entire religion have to, why can't it just be individuals? Why can't it be Kingston's a prick? <laughs> we gotta kill him. Do you expect me to listen to this nonsense? Yes. I see that you have become too close to the witches. Oh no. You are no longer my students. I will punish you with my own hands. God is Lavos. Didn't you watch two streams ago, Eve? <laughs> God is a weird comet. <laughs> a weird asteroid bug thing. Sir Heath, you would actually fight against us? 
Oh my god. Silence out. I'm tired of hearing your protests. Then I will fight you. <laughs> His cloak shirt. He's he he swapped it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, because you know what they do. They just mirror it. <laughs> like this. Brother! Alf? Alf? Everyone step aside. Oh, I I'm dueling. I will not be defeated by a traitor. If I win, please just listen to us. This is it, Alf. This is it, Alf? Ah, uh, fucking... Okay, I'm really glad I upgraded him. Okay. Um... Swap the screens. I remembered! He's in here! I remembered this time! Prepare yourself. Oh, dude, I'm fucking fighting on top of a... Oh, really? You just get first attack and damage? Great. Love it. Thanks, okay, bro. Thanks, dude. Thanks, dude! How much life do you have? You have 417. Um, uh, you know, we'll just... Yeah, not yet. 91, okay. Chances are I'll be able to get a level in the fight. Maybe, hopefully. Are you fucking serious? You're joking, right? Are you actually... Are you buttering my biscuits? <laughs> what? When did I... When did I save state? Last. Equipment. Okay, so I have everything still equipped, so I think I came out and saved before, um, before the, the, the before I went to, like, the library and did all the talking, I think. So I'll just do this. I don't know if it actually does anything. Uh, uh. Yeah. I don't think it does, but might as well. Okay, return. So, now let's advance the story. Okay, and this is why we like turbo mode. Man, that was kind of bullshit. Freaking, he gets a first turn attack. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do save state two on this one. He gets first turn attack and then immediately gets FP. Like a full FP. Oh, he starts on two FP. So that's why. Because he's just straight up cheating. Actually just cheating. Great. That's dumb as shit. That's Prepare yourself. honestly the most garbage thing ever. It's getting tough. You check it. I mean, I lost. <laughs> like, I got killed, and then it said defeat. <laughs> so, I presume that means it is... It is winnable. Okay. Who's next? Okay, move. Just m trying to move him into a corner. I think there's a game. Yeah. So either it's an amount of time I have to stay alive, or I actually have to beat him. With him doing that much damage to me, every fucking hit. Like, 
like... Um... Kinda garbage. Not gonna lie. Like, I can't... You're joking, right? Like... <laughs> like, what do you actually expect me to do, game? I, I can't... Oh, my God. Okay. Um... Let's see if there's any equipment I can put on him to give him more guard. Or more HP, maybe? That would be good. Obviously, you should repent for your sense. I mean, obviously. You know, I can agree with that. Um, okay, so there's no real way for me to do any more. Um, uh, buy that. Don't know how. I think it's only going to give me five more defense, but not even defense. It's freaking resist, which isn't even what he's doing, I don't think. But whatever. It's better, I guess. Um. Oh, wait. Let's go back in. Because maybe there are. Okay. Got that. Got the highest defense armor. Let's resist. Yeah, like this fight is just garbanzo beans of the highest order. Because it's like, even if they just gave me two characters, right, that would be manageable. But the fact that it's only one and I don't even get first turn, like that's the issue. Okay, so... Let's take a fight. Um, to try and um, just get some XP for him. Because um, that's all I can really think to do. Okay, and everyone move down to the right, because last time I did this map it was pain in the ass because I didn't have everyone all together. Yeah. And this is just a good way to get XP. See, the worst part is I can't even, like, stably get a shit ton of XP with Alf. Because as I was saying, Alf is not a great character. He's actually pretty bad. Because he can't buff himself. He can't heal other people. So, I can only get XP by damaging others or killing them. Right, like, like, he just has ranged moves, none of which are, like, stronger, it seems, than his regular attack. They're just his attack, but far away. Aaron just says, abuse Magnum. I don't know what that... Okay, so, that's... Magnum is... Uh, Magnum is, um... His, I guess his strong move, but it's like a ranged gun attack. So I guess the idea would be to just remain at a distance and shoot him with that, I guess, maybe? But I do think getting more XP on him is also uh, a good thing to do. Um... And this will just help me get XP on everyone. Yeah, so Magnum is this move, where it's honestly pretty far out. And, oh wow, that is strong. Okay, so Magnum is his strong move. Okay, good to know. 
Okay. So that's actually really good to learn. Because I did not realize that. want everyone kind of together more so than last time because having them spread out made it really difficult to really do anything but if they're at least a little bit close then I can manage that. Heal hail so that's good. Okay, aid. This is just for XP. Okay, and they're all just pumping their heels onto him. Okay, level up to 31. Uh, action, skill, and um, takes 30. How much life does he have? Because before. God damn. It takes 32. You see there's 192. Son of a bitch. Really? Like, you could not be more of an asshole about it. 215. Yeah. He does that much, though. Um... Strike sixty three. Yeah, basically, what I'm, what I'm gonna want to do is try to get as much um, like damage on other units without killing them as possible. That way, I can try and get uh, Alf to get the kill to get the killing blow on them, with the exception of these guys. I'll just use stat boosts, heals, and other stuff to get the to get the good uh, good XP that Alf is not allowed to get, which is annoying. really actually sucks that he has no moves that I could use to try and just actually stably get him XP. Everyone else has moves like that. Every single person. Like, whether or not it's a heal or a self-boot. Like, even if I could guarantee 5 XP on him every time I use him, right? I could go to another map where there aren't many enemies, and just have him spam <laughs> that move and get 5 XP at a time. Also, probably not be as frustrating if uh, you also got XP for 
getting hit, right? Like, if you took damage and also got XP, I think that would greatly alter how it feels, right? Because it's like, okay, cool. It's only 6 XP, too. My turn, huh? Like, he is the least efficient character. It really sucks. Because, like, the enemies aren't so weak that I could just send him in alone. But they're not strong enough to give him much XP. Uh, okay, I'm just gonna try and finish out this fight. And then move over to seeing if I can't just use Magnum. Because, like, the thing that really annoys me about it, right, is that the fight starts with me getting hit. Like, it's not even, like... It's not even like, oh yeah, no, just... It's like, no, you're starting out taking damage. Which blows. Okay, you need to... Get some work done on you. It's like, that. that is always, like, sucks when it's like, oh, this boss... Th like, a boss fight that starts with you getting hit and it's, like, unavoidable. Or, like, a move that there's no way to counter in any way, shape, or form. Like, those kinds of moves just suck to do. Sucks to play against. Sucks to, like, have exist. It's like, what? There's literally nothing I can do. XP. Skyfire. Zero, but. Okay. Action skill. First aid. Yeah, I can just keep healing him. He has two. Like, like, Alf is two levels below where other people are. Like, that is how annoying it is. Like, it, hurt, it hurts to be able to say, like, oh, yeah, like, this character is, like, harder to get, it's, like, less useful and harder to get XP for than a healer that is, like, five levels below, right? Like, because if I wanted to, I could just, I could grind Cecile out. And that would just be a matter of using heal four times. And then leveling up and just doing that over and over and over again after I've, like, trapped an enemy, like, a fi one final enemy remaining. And just doing that. And that's perfect. Like, it could happen. That would be an easy way to do it. So you get 30 XP every time you do big heal. So... Why not? Okay, so her range is also similar to, like, a bow person. Well, she also uses a freaking lamp, so I guess that kind of makes sense. Wouldn't exactly think of a lamp as a close-range, uh... close-range weapon. First aid. Yeah, definitely not... See, I was expecting, I was like, oh, maybe with the progress I'm making in this game. Now, quickly, I got to chapter, like, 15, 15, 16. I'll, like, maybe I'll be able to finish this, like, the next time I play it. And now I'm like, that's, that's not happening. Like, there is no way that I'm going to be able to get through nearly enough of the game. To do with that uh, clean light. Um, uh, just wait. Magic. Heal. Just give yourself charge. Okay. 
six. There we go. Give me one level. There we go. 18. He's at 31. So a little bit of a boost to his stats. Wasn't completely a waste of time. Um, how's my girl Lucia doing? Hope you're doing well. Hey, Elf. Don't you worry about what your party is going through. Don't you worry about me. I'll watch out from now on. Always. Always. Wow, oh, you really care about your friends. I'm impressed, Elf. Maybe I'll join up with you guys. Nah. <laughs> yeah, happiness. Okay. No. We're gonna save. Save. Save state one and two. Enter the area. Advance the story. Okay. And then get all through this. Da -da 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 -da. And then I have to try that magnum thing. Okay. So I'll do a save state one here. Because I already got one and two. And did the base save. So hoping maybe hoping maybe my speed is now fast enough to get get a first turn or something. I don't know. Use Mag. 118. Yeah. On almost half of my bar. He comes in, does that, and it kills me. I, I, I actually don't know what to do. Fucking garbage, man. Um, is there... Is fire damage? Is there lightning damage? Reduction on anyone? Is there big guard on anyone? He has guard. There's a sleep. Guard six. thing is I just need more defense because if I can't even survive two hits right like because I need to at, at some point I need to attack that's just the case <laughs> because the thing is FP doesn't use MP so he'll never run out especially if he's going to just have it that readily um the only other way I could imagine trying to do it would be to grind out again, get him close to leveling, and then time it such that when he attacks on his first or second turn in, in the fight, he levels up and gets a full heal, and therefore doesn't have to use a turn to heal himself. That's the only way I can imagine it. Because he comes in, does an attack, does 93 damage. I'm now at 219. I come over here. And I don't have any FP. Like, I think that's the bullshit part, right? Like, that's the most asinine part. He starts with two FP. He starts with two super moves in his pocket. Like, how am I... How is this supposed to even be a reasonable fight? Because, like, I get that I'm underleveled. Like, he's t three levels ahead of me. But still. <laughs> like, we're not even starting on the same fucking playing ground. <laughs> like, it's actually just garbage. Actually, if I do 
is he still within range here? Yes, okay. So I'll do this, that way he doesn't get like side hit bonus, maybe. Still gonna do frigging... Cause I think if I move, I actually can't. Anything else. Okay, here I come. Oh, I got two turns in a row. Okay. Interesting. And now I'm out of MP. I will punish you all. Is the most damage I've ever done. If I can, t okay. So the extra guard did help. Um, action. Item. Detonic. Okay, and wait. Okay. Okay. Action. Item. Vitamin. Heal up. Wait. Okay, that's 90. It's fine. Action. Item. Magiment, because I need my MP for Magnum. Wait. Okay, if I survive that, that's fine. So then... Action, item... V-tonic. 250 health. Wait. Okay, you do that. 92. Okay. So... The idea is Magnum do 32. Okay. I was hoping I wouldn't have to move at the same time. Okay. Let's move up one. Magnum. 107. Do that. Good. He does that. It's 94. And now I have 2 FP, so. And I also have the perfect amount for another Magnum, but I have 2 FP. 132, 100% hit, right? Fucking die, you asshat. Here we go. Yeah, it's at 92 XP, so this is freaking. It's honestly a waste of a kill to get 72 X. Like, as I was like, waste of XP. Freaking he he is an annoying boss and a waste of XP. See, that one didn't even make sense. Why did I get two turns in a row as Alf? <laughs> Like, that's the- it threw me off! I was like, wait, I got to go twice in a row! What? Double tap there. Sir Heath! God is going to destroy the planet, not save it! We are supposed to prevent God from waking up! So what? Huh? Even if that were true, it doesn't matter to me. I have no doubt that the witches are evil beings. The witches still cause innocent people suffering. It is my duty, my mission, and my wish to purge them from this world. Sir Heath. Yeah, abusing the system. That was quite entertaining. Yeah. Cardinal Kingston. I have always enjoyed seeing a student pit himself against his master. Kingston. I had thought that you were obliterated in Iris's attack, but you've run here. I suppose I shouldn't underestimate you people. Iris, do not fail me this time. I will succeed. That's the Steel Witch! Steel Witch? Her? Oh my god, hey, look. Now, Iris, destroy them all! I obey. Activating cannon mode. Iris? Is that you, Iris? Oh, okay, so... I presume his hatred is like, Oh, a witch killed my childhood friend. Oh, wait. Childhood friend was abducted by the church and experimented on. Yay! <laughs> you get to see the hypocrisy of your religion. Yeah. <laughs> I'm betting sister. Okay. <gasps> Sir Heath? She calls him Sir, though. So... Chip. <laughs> Too much Attack emotion. Subroutine aborted. Attack failed. <laughs> Attack is a subroutine? Okay. That could be programmed. I 
see that we couldn't completely erase her memory. Error. Error. <laughs> you useless scrap witch. Oh. Oh well. I have ordered the Crow Knights to this town in case something like this occurred. Oh. What? Oh, looky. We're surrounded. Oh, no. Now, he Command your soldiers. Yeah, he's... Order them to capture the witches and the traitors. Shouldn't it be to kill them? But no, you want to experiment on them. Because you are an asshole. Do it if you've got the stone. Oh, man, I'll fucking keep fighting, bitch! The nature witch will not fall to you puny human. My dick is eight times bigger than yours, Heath. If you fight with your full power, you could easily destroy this town. They'd be asking for it, though. No, don't do it. But do it, though. But it would be pretty cool. What are you doing, Heath? <sighs> Never mind, then. I will do it. Knights who serve the it. light of God, capture these traitors! Yo, let me fight some fucking knights. Come on, there we go. Yes, your holiness! Come on, men, we've gotta catch them all! Yeah! Oh, they're gonna get us, yeah? Mel, can you warp us out of here? I can't teleport this many people by myself. Then I'll have to! No! What choice do we have? Uh! No! Who the hell? Hey, the enemy squad is split up! They're fighting, they're fighting each other? There's some guy running over there and he's attacking the knights. Oh, hello there. I am Samurai. Who the hell are you? Whoa, it's a Samurai! Okay. Called it. <laughs> I shall help you in the name of justice. Follow me. What? What did he mean? Let's just trust him for now. 23 skadood, folks! Everyone run! Ah, what are you doing? Don't let them get away! You, you babbling fools! Yeah, what's up? It seems they used our superior numbers against us. Y your holiness! I'm sorry we performed so miserably! Dragons and witches who seek to darken God's blessed light. The holy day, when I will give my body to God, is drawing near. Make no mistake about that, Cardinal Kingston. Yes, your holiness! Oh no! Gonna have to beat the shit out of him! That was a surprise! Oh wow! Are you all okay? Yeah, we're doing pretty good. Yeah. To save my lovely witches with every ounce of my being. Endeavor. That's a pretty good Pokemon move, depending on, because that's the. I think that isn't isn't that the move that makes your HP equal, or is Endeavor one of those ones where it's lower the HP, the higher the damage. I can't quite remember. <laughs> um, there's no need for that. Don't touch me. <laughs> Uh, Endeavor causes the target's HP to equal the Q. Okay, that's what it did. It will deduct the difference from the target's HP. This move does not. There's nothing if the user's HP is greater than or equal to the target's type immunity is not ignored. Yeah, dude, so that's when you want to get, like, Shedinja with Endeavor. Because, you know, just down to one. <laughs> You. you saved us all. Dude, you got a pretty big sword, man. Are you really a samurai? The real McCoy son? McCoy? What? <laughs> no, I'm Sephiroth, but with black hair now. I'm Theo. Nice to meet you. I don't talk. Hey! You ought to at least introduce yourself, Buckaroo Bonsai! <laughs> 
Oh, wow. I am Kai, of the Euros Knights. Ah! The people that got just annihilated. Kai. I'm sorry, what? There's a Death Smiles too. <laughs> what? The Euros Knights? Hmm. I sense that we are being followed. Mm -hmm. Huh? Wait up! Oh, no! More warning! No! <laughs> Gotta keep going. A tragedy occurred. My friend Daikon arrived at the dinner table, completely transformed! What Lady Vanessa said after that truly hurt. The radish at the bottom of the pot tastes the best. Aw. Cause it gets to soak in all them juices. Okay, let's save. So I don't have to do any of that. A larky again. This mouse was a bullet hell game about gothic angels, which I remember only due to the fact that the final boss was named Tyrannosatan, the Demonic Imperador. Okay. See, when you said Death Mouse, I was thinking of like a... Like, wasn't it like a clown-themed, like, destruction derby game? Or something like that? I was thinking of that. Terrace Springs of Lawston. God love them terraced springs. Chapter 16, Second Thoughts. Maybe? Yeah. We should be fine for now, right? I suggest that we should stop for a rest. I'm very tired. Yes. Is Sir Heath after us too? Probably. He wouldn't listen to what we had to say. For Sir Heath, witches are the enemy, and always will be. I'm not his student anymore. Damn it! Big brother! I'm sorry, Theo. I just want to be alone for now. Hey, Alf! Hey, Alf! Yeah. This must be tough for Alf. Even though we knew her, her dude was super religious and devout and did not give a shit. <laughs> and probably would have attacked and I saw it coming from a mile the goddamn way. He looked up to Sir Heath so strongly. <laughs> Lucia, where are you going? Theo, come back here. Huh? Why? Let's leave them alone for now. Okay. I wish I had more information. About what? The Steel Witch. She seemed surprised when she saw Sir Heath. I noticed that. Curious. When she saw Sir Heath, the Steel Witch stopped attacking. Sir Heath seemed to be surprised when he saw the Steel Witch as well. What do you think that all meant? If I knew that, I wouldn't be wishing for more information. Hey guys, don't tell off about this, alright? I don't want him to have another thing to worry about. You're right. <gasps> oh god, get tired. I'm getting tired and it is only 8 o'clock. <laughs> Ugh, I'm gonna have to break out the uh, cheesecake a little bit later. Get, the, get some sugar in me to uh, pump up that energy. Ugh. I'll probably also get some tissues. Because, like, I'm not sick, but, like, year round I always get, like, clogged nose. I think it's because, like, I'm pretty sure I have a deviated septum where, like, I just cannot breathe through one of my nostrils. But the nostril will switch depending on, like, like, if I'm lying down on my bed, if I lie down on one side enough, it will, like, swap to be, like, the bed side down is the one I can't breathe through. <laughs> but if I s switch over, it happens as well. I just get one of those the first night I have my window open. Ah, okay, yeah, because spring is happening. Yeah, God, it's very, it was 66 degrees, it's 66 degrees in here, and I don't have the heat on, and, like, my window is open all day, like, damn, it is... Getting to that point where I'm gonna have to bring down my fan from my bookshelf back onto my uh, thing to just have uh, have it going during the streams. Why wouldn't you listen to me? It's almost like you were <laughs> indoctrinated by a religion. I thought you would. <coughs> Boo hoo! Are you upset that Sir Heath abandoned you? L Lucia, I wasn't crying. It's fine. I told you to leave me alone. Told you to leave me alone. Yeah, there we go. I live at a lake and the pond gets bad. Ooh, yeah. 
Yeah, anywhere where there's a lot of plant life. Are you crying, Alf? N no! Let me ask you one question, then. Didn't you just tell Sir Heath that God is the one he should be fighting? Yeah, I'm right, aren't I? When did you decide that? Huh? We've come together because of all that's happened to us. But I never heard you say that you were going to fight your god before today. C can't you figure that out for yourself? If I hadn't made that decision, I wouldn't be working with you witches. Besides, I'm your rim, right? Then stop whining about Sir Heath. He is serving the god you are now fighting. That makes him our enemy. Uh, yeah. Think about it. What if Sir Heath fi finds us again? Are you going to run away or stand and fight? I mean, we do have a whole bunch of other people that could just fight him instead. So. I. 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 I'm a goofy gooba rock! <laughs> We're all goofy goobas rock! Goofy 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 goobas! Uh. I remember I was so surprised as a kid when they say, like. When the, he says frickin' in the in the song, he says, no, no frickin' way! And I was like, oh my god, he said that in a children's cartoon! What? <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> what if one of us tries to kill Sir Heath? <gasps> yeah, right? I, like, I got, I got totally whoop-faced. <laughs> I won't let that happen! Then what if Sir Heath tries to kill one of us? <sighs> Never mind. You're in no shape to fight with us. You can't be my rim if you can't let go of some things in order to protect this world. Sir Heath was more than my teacher. I looked up to him. He was like a brother. I don't want him to be... to be my enemy. Then I guess I can't depend on you anymore. Oh. I thought you were the one I could count on. But apparently I was wrong. Just give me some time, babe. Goodbye, you crybaby. Oh! Dropping the C word. Hey Lucia, wait! Where are you going? I'm not being done. I'm not done being verbally abused yet. Turn the world map. I mean, okay, let's turn to the world map. Saves. Save. Save. <laughs> Just make it as many. Try to do everything I possibly can to make it so if I do have to restart for some reason, like I lose the fight, I'm not I have to do a lot. <laughs> Speak with Theo. Sir Heath didn't listen to us. Yeah. I thought you'd understand. We were doing what we did to protect you, Theo. Indeed. But why does Sir Heath hate my lovely wishes with such passion? Perhaps he has a personal reason to dislike witches so badly. Not even I know it, everything about Sir Heath's past. But Sir Heath was the one who taught us the importance of protecting each other. Alf. Mel. Where did Lucia go? Who cares? What happened between the two of you? N nothing. Nothing happened. Bacchus. Aw, did you guys have an argument? <laughs> Lucia's got off by herself again! You are Lucia's rim, aren't you? What are you doing? Cool. Think about what you say, yeah? Don't be so stubborn, yeah? Nikolai. Do you think we're being hunted because of what the church says? Because they say that the witches are evil? I believe that the church is pursuing both the witches and the lapistier. Regardless of the truth, as long as they continue with their facade of punishing evil, they will have the public support. Is the church trying to use us? We believe we've believed in the church all this time. Was it all a lie? Yes. But what about the steel witch? Creating life in a laboratory disturbs the natural flow of life. Is Kingston trying to play God? He reveres God, yet he wants to be God's equal. It just doesn't make sense. But not everything the church taught us was wrong, though. I believe in protecting what's important to me. If battle cannot be avoided, the one with the weaker heart will always lose. If you want to be truly strong, you must believe in yourself. 
And if you cannot believe in yourself, believe in the me that believes in you. Tengen Tapa, Gurn Lagan, manly spirit and spiral energy. Nice trying to create Altina because he's a weeb. I mean, honestly. If I can't, I'm going to make a daughter because no one would want to fuck Kingston. Look at him. He's, he's ugly and honestly deplorable with no moral compass. <laughs> make the daughter. Okay, advance the story. Stupid Lucia, running off by herself. <laughs> I finally caught up to you, you traitors! I swear upon my abs, pecs, and delts that I will capture you all! <laughs> More church troops. How unfortunate that we should encounter him. Beware this famous sword I hold in my right hand! The Regulus Heart! Only the leader of the Zephyroth Knights can use this edge! That is a real line. Sounds like something he would have made up. I love this guy, right? <laughs> I shall put this awesome blade to use by punishing the traitors! Hey, Mr. Flexo. Why is that sword still in its scabbard? Get shut up and stuck in the sheath! Ugh. I remember the previous leader using it, though. Perhaps the sword is rusted into its scabbard. Can't even take care of your weapon and you call yourself a knight? That is deplorable. Crap it, you stupid snots! With my ultimate physique, I don't even need a weapon to smash you. I'll bound you all flat without breaking a sweat. And you didn't need to steal that sword, you idiot. Idiot? Disrespectful swerp! <laughs> okay, Zimpachi. Chill. <laughs> Zimpachi. <laughs> I suppose that when the master is a fool, his students will also be fools. What? Let me tell you something. Your teacher, Heath, was demoted from his role as one of Johannes's guards. He was made the leader of some remote army, and now he's not even that. And it's all because of you, you traitors. This is what he deserves. Because of us, Sir Heath was... If I had been demoted so shamefully, I couldn't go on without hiding my face. But your precious Arc Knight Heath is alive, clinging to his former title. What a pathetic loser. You son of a... Don't talk about Sir Heath like that. Shut up! Prepare yourself, punks. I'll show you the strength of Andre's Crow Knight Super Brigade. Kill these kids! Yeah, I'm bald. Okay, so we got Kai, level 33. Yuki Kage. Okay. Um, not gonna use him. He's the highest level person. Um, I don't have Lucia, so... <sighs> I'll take Cecile as another healer and then just uh, keep her in the back. Defeat all oh, uh, Boom. Remembered it. Love it. Okay. Oh, of course, friggin' Cecile's at, like, the friggin' side closest to an enemy. Ugh, son of a tit brick. Ah, oh, you bastard. Okay, um... Yeah, tit brick. That's a, that's a good word. Okay, action, skill, speed. Action. Let's wait for here. Magic. Guard up. Give everyone that good guard. Um, I'm gonna keep him up. Action. Skill. Um. 
74, yeah, I'll do that. Get a tag hit, 14, good, okay. Okay, here I come! Okay, here I come, baby! Hey, yo, baby! Hey, yo, baby! Just gonna come over here, you wanna give me a little smooch on the lips? Hey, yo, baby! <laughs> oh, God. Uh, Magnum! Magnum, please! Bang. Oh yeah, he still has the two guard My things turn, on. Huh? That's uh, going to be a tad annoying. Okay, move him over here. Action, skill, charge! Okay, that's tech up. Okay, ah, oh, damn it, get back hit. Okay, ah, oh, damn it, you've healed him? Okay, well that's... Here I come! So let's move him up here. Action, magic, guard up. Pop that on all of them. He levels, that's good. Time to punish evil! Time to punish evil, my friends! Action, nope. Magic, heal. Good. Okay, get them all. Keep them all on the up and up. Okay, you need to move out over here and drop an aqua on her. Let's try pulling the aqua as a sub. Which combat system do you prefer? Beat em up, turn based card games on motorcycles. I mean, arguably, turn based and card games on motorcycles are exactly the same. Uh, did I attack? Did I use aqua instead of aid? Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Bitch. Okay. Back yeah. Ah. Oh god. Oh yeah. Cause she, I didn't get her a, a defense uh, item, did I? Okay. So let's just punch you really hard, and then we're going to stun shot. guy. Because he's at 251 health, and I'm not sure uh, Leon would be able to kill him. Okay, action, Skittle, Magnum. 135, good damage. Action, attack, 147, yeah, no, okay. So he has to use his X Lash. Do 220. Okay. 42. Level up. That's fine. Just need to remove some people from the playing field right now. Okay. Okay, so you only get five if you use an item, even if it's on another person. It's good to know. Let's see. Um. Okay, the healers are gonna get their turn soon. Um. Uh, action. Magic. Guard up. Guys, wait. Oh fuck. Okay. Cool. Okay. They decided not to attack the uh, Alf, which is very good. Magic heal. 
Do that. Get her health up. Enough to be able to survive that hit. Damn it. Okay, I can't move there. Can move there. Do that. He can get a level from that. Good. Action. Oh, wait. Ah, god damn it. Uh, what's the turn order right now? I just need to check to make sure. Okay, now it goes mob. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, that's 11, then. Okay. 11 is mine. Okay, I was getting... Wait. Oh, no, that's 4. Okay, I was... Okay. Now. Okay. okay. Getting really confused. Okay. So let's go over here. Action. Okay. How much health do you have? You have 327. Two hundred seventy-nine, two hundred eighty-four. That's good. Let's see your best. Uh, let's have you come over here, magic. One oh seven. Yeah, that's worth it. Get you out of there. Level up. Heal you. Good. New spell. You're only at 28 health. That's not great. Um, let's move you back in the way. Just have you heal yourself with a item. Because right now it's a little too dangerous. Because he can't... He wouldn't level up from a... He wouldn't level up from a, um, a kill. So I don't want to risk that. You might, though. Oh my god, is that out of range or bad elevation? Oh god, okay. Keeps being out of range, so I think I'm too close. So if I can kill him, I might be able to. I don't want to do 44. Shit. Actually, get close enough. Uh, okay, so you know, I'm gonna move here, and I'm also gonna have her just use a regular 100 health min. Okay, that's gonna hurt her. It's level 36. Jesus. 221. Okay, that's big. Probably gonna hit Cecile. No, he hit him. That's not good. Damn it! Okay, and they're just getting a whole bunch of turns one after the other. That hurts, man. And they KO'd Leon, my one of my main damage dealers. Ah. Love it. Fucking great. Um, a stun shot. Actually, this one is. Uh, you know, that's worth it. Do that. Take out one of them.
Okay, smash that guy in the back. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Magic. Heal. That she levels. Heal. Okay. Sixteen? Are you fucking serious, dude? Flash drive. Oh, she can't move. Check. Buying grab. How much? Seventy one. Seven. Okay, here I come. Skill. Shotgun. There we go. Good widespread damage. Oh god, we're still on this fight. I zoned out for it. Yeah, I mean, this one... Honestly, this one had... I don't think that this fight necessarily has been taking necessarily too long, or above expectations in terms of amount of time. Uh, it's just that... A lot of units. Here. 
hit him, get some XP, level up. Yeah, if I can, because I'm, I'm hoping, right, that if I can keep, maybe, oh wait, maybe what I should do, just to get rid of the potential, right, see if I can't do something that would you, your stuff does so little damage. Uh, but I do want to use... 34... 29... Your base attack would do how much? 23... Make it so that, like, they'll use a heal on themselves instead of big guy. That would be best. And if I can successfully take out this bitch, because that will level him up. Wasted a lot of XP, 55 XP there, but better than... get her a new, like, defense. Like, I didn't get her better armor, so she's not great. Um, don't know if Leo is even hurt, but... Oh yeah, he's paralyzed, so he can't move, I guess. I guess that makes sense. can do it. Grar, dragon hands. It did something to him. Oh, poison killed him. Ooh, okay. Poison death is actually the worst kind of death because it doesn't give anyone any XP. Okay, good to know. Good to know. Can't do that. You're level 30. He's level 33. gonna have her do freaking this on him because she'll level up from that new skill melee need to worry about it uh, you can just do a regular attack this should probably level him up yep there we go good 
kill. Nice. Good. Like to see it. Can wait. Mm. I want to know how far this guy can move. Um. That is one thing that would greatly affect uh, what I am willing to do. Mugen. Decrease target's MP. Ah, oh, interesting. <laughs> hey, don't cast as much. Please. Okay, so let's come over here. Flash drive mock slash. 111. But let's say I just use Magnum. 101. Yeah, we're gonna do that. didn't move all that far, so I'll just use this as a pure shot. Okay, so this is, I guess, his AOA, which is neat that he even has one. I was not necessarily expecting one. Okay, so I'll heal, just get him some XP. Her XP. Her heart out of harm's way, potentially. Okay, here I Can't even move far enough. And then here we have our boy. Oh, and his thing is also an AOA. Okay. Good to know. Yeah! Slash, 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 slash. And he's gonna die and give me more than the necessary amount. 72? Okay. There's going to be wasted XP anyway, regardless, I think, whoever killed him, but I need Alf to get levels, because he seems to be the only character that is given solo maps. <laughs> so, let's not, um, let's not deny him. Uh, okay. Let's talk to Mavi. Uh, how's she doing? I haven't talked to her. Yeah, and then swap. That was good. Ah, you brats! You betraying God's will! But God's sword is justice! God will punish you with his might! A sword isn't meant to hurt people. It's used to protect them. Literally, a sword was made to kill things. And fight things. Huh? I've heard that phrase before. Oh, the previous leader of the Zephyroth and I used to say that. That fool was happy to be called the Lion King. Lion King? He was so conceited, just because he was the leader. I decided I had to punish him myself instead of waiting for God to do it. I'm a much better leader than he ever was. <laughs> oh, that was fun. <laughs> what did you just say? You punished the Lion King? Yes, when the pirates came in and tried to plunder the church, I killed him as he fought the pirates and threw the lot of them in the ocean. And now I am the leader of the Zephyrot Knights. See, the way they talked about the Lion King, I was like, oh, he's like an ancient guy. He's like hundreds of years ago. But I guess not. <laughs> One generation ago, and there are, <laughs> there are already books praising him. Gotta say, guy must have been that damn awesome. <laughs> ow, 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 I'm hurt from this battle. Oh. I'll let you live this time. Again. Hold it, Andre. You won't get away from me that easily. Leon. Sorry, Alf. We're gonna have to part ways for now. Huh? The Lion King that Metalhead killed was my father. Oh, okay. What? I have to avenge him. I will never forgive Andre. Now that I know the truth, I have to go after him. I'll be back after I take him down. Later, guys. Leon! Wait, Leon, you can't! I'm sorry, Cecile. I'll see you in my dreams. N no. What a smooth operator! BRB gonna murder. He's quite bold. Quite bold. Damn it, he's like my main damage dealer. <laughs> Leon, if you aren't here, what can I. 
He seemed very determined. My lovely Cecile tried to stop him, but th even that didn't work. <laughs> if he can get revenge on that screwy torpedo, he'll come back. Yeah, big brother. Let's believe in Leon. Leon has his own goals. We have our own things to take care of, too. Her own things? Are we going to try to stop God with the lovely witches? You told Sir Heath that, at least. That's because I thought he would join us to help the world. But Sir Heath didn't want to understand our situation. I... I don't want to fight Sir Heath. Elf. I see. So this is why Lucia left. You wimp. What? I understand that you respect Heath. I also understand that you feel like Heath has abandoned you. But you are forgetting something more important than that. More important? She's correct, Elf. Who have you sworn to protect? The planet. The whole planet. Anyone in particular? Lucia. See, you do remember. But Sir Heath! This is going to be tough. Hey, what would Sir Heath say to you if he was here right now? What? He'd probably say something like, I'll pound some sense into your head. Listen, Alf. Sir Heath always taught us that it's very important that a knight cannot run away from those he has sworn to protect. Isn't that right? Theo. I'm a failure for big brother for being lectured by my kid bro. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. My mind's made up. I'll keep fighting. Even if Sir Heath stands in our way. That's what Sir Heath has taught us to do. Elf. Big brother. Yay. There you go. Let's go look for Lucia, everyone. <laughs> now that we've lost another character, I'm going to keep I'm going to be keeping a close watch on you, Elf. Show me what you've got. Bring it on. What? Cut me some slack. I'll be watching you too. Bring it on! I'm glad to see such enthusiasm. Now I know your spirit is strong. Thanks. Here, Elf, take this. It works well. You have obtained Ranta. Ranta, 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 Ball Z. What? I was only goofing around, but I ended up completely burning one of my friends. I totally apologize, Vivi's Coppin. Okay. So, I'm actually gonna go back down here. Shop. Buy. The armor. Yeah, I'm gonna buy the doggy for her, because she was taking some massive hits in that fight. Tank was sick. Okay, and then I can also... Um, do that. Could have also taken off the white doggy from him. If I never planned to use Kai, but if I might be forced to, I don't want to not have him have any armor on. Um, oh, wait, no. No, I need to go back. No. Oh! Oh, the speaks change when you revisit. Interesting. Okay, items. You know, just give me 14. It's only 700. Um, get that up to 15. I need I need my heels to be um pretty pretty good. Like I want to make sure I do not ever uh, run out of them. Okay, so here's the big question. Okay, so I'm gonna do a save state right here. I'm also gonna do a regular save. Can I go past regular encounters if I've already done them before? Okay, I can. They they optionize it. That's good to know. Which village enter the area? Because I do want to come to the workshop. Andre R and Blue Do. Oh, okay. With oh, okay, and you can just literally give it. Like, hey, do you want? Gives you this level three, this bonus, this bonus on this armor or weapon. Oh, you just also just put on accessories. So if you just plan on having one except, see the thing is I don't want to use it on 
anything right now. Because I don't know when uh, when it's one of those things where like I'm gonna be buying more um, okay but you all also you do get a lot of these it seems to the point where like it would be a lot of money for me to do it uh, yeah okay but okay but it's also just good to know that um, it's good to know that I can just decide not to take wait so when I did that I entered the battle no and then come over here enter the area no then I want to come back Oh, okay, so maybe you only get one free one. That's stupid. That's, like, really dumb. Or maybe it's, like, maybe certain directions, maybe? Like, oh, if you go into this... one. Okay, save. Save over that. If I choose to enter this area again, is it an encounter? No, okay, so it's literally just, hey, do you want to look at the art? Okay. Uh, I think I can do... one or two more maps before I'm just pooped. Promise way. Okay, eight. Um, you, you. Um, you. 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 This is like the only time I'll ever be able to be like, okay, I can... He here's... Oh god, this map sucks. He here's when I can reasonably uh, level her up. See, I feel like the decreased target's MP will be very hit or miss, depending on how much MP it actually does, right? Like... That'll be the deciding factor. Is it a good amount, or is it actually kind of garbage? Save Magnum for a bit later. Attack up on Mavi. Uh, get heal on you guys for the good stuff. Level 25 right now. So that's pretty good. Okay, this will block this guy in. Uh, she's at 56, so you know, that's not a bad. It's not bad for a kill. 72. Hmm. Not really focusing on who is going to be getting any given kills right now. I think everyone's doing pretty well. There's no other than Cecile, uh, who's quite low. Everyone else is pretty solid. Okay, let's do mine on you. Let's get 162 before you can even approach. Uh, actually, 
that's a tad too far out. Let's do that. Magic tech up. But he's still level up, so that's good. Come on. Uh, hey, -o. 93. Let's get do some damage. She was at 99. Any amount of XP would be a waste, so. Let's not have it be a big one. 31, there we go, get a kill. 60, level up. Love it. Luckily, I got a whole bunch of healers, so I don't really have to worry that much. Two. Action flash drive. That's Zook and Zoom. Do that. Level up. Fully healed. That's good. So, yeah, I'll move her over here. That way I can at least space her. Punch this bitch really freaking hard. <laughs> okay, here I come. Fucking gut punch. Action skill. Use shoddy, shoddy yeah. like a melon in my. Are you missed both? Here I go. Isn't your tech up? <laughs> like what? Excuse me while I just grow absolutely flabbergasted. Okay, it's starting to become an issue where everyone is not, um, like a guy heals, but only up to, like, this chunk of the map, and then I'm gonna have to start. Oh, did I just heal the enemy? I think I just healed the enemy. Okay, we can at least get her. Over to this chunk of the map, then I'm good. Yeah, just really far. 
Bazooka. Okay, he has high resistance, so we'll just do this. Plant Bazooka! It's not a bazooka, that's just like a sniper rifle. A, ri a machine gun sniper rifle. Okay, wait. Okay. Let's come down. Seal goes down, it does, it's not a bad thing. Uh, you're at 44 XP, so you might level off. Okay. Speed up. Kill him, 66, good, that levels, so full heal. Love to plan it out like that. Action magic. Yeah. Attack up. Okay, so attack up actually has a lower range than guard. I guess because it's so much more uh, useful, maybe. Six. This is actually good. This is one of the fights where I'm like, okay, there's no real issues going on. Let me just jinx it real quick. <laughs> um, oh, wait. I could potentially use his AOA, depending on 
much height, I guess. Yeah. yeah. Exploding arrow! damage that way gets to it the healer will probably just do a heal um, there we go hit three people and kill one of them get a nice 60 xp so we take those oh missed bitch yeah that's what i like to see okay i'll move down for them so i can tech up on you guys level up her with that she has 30 XP. So let's come over here and punch this guy's teeth in for 18. Come over here. Shoddy. Like a melody in my head. Magnum. Oh, are you shoddy or Magnum? Um, you come over here. Attack this one. Side. Do 20. Uh, you, can you attack? No. But pure shadow gets you with AOA does 14, which is good. You can come for your action magic attack up. No, okay. Well, as long as I get it. And he levels up. Yeah, this is good. Just <laughs> it's like every everything is just working. <laughs> It's how I imagined most of the fights in this game would go. Uh, and lo and behold, I was uh, pleasantly, quote unquote, quote unquote, surprised that uh, it did not. Because I, I guess like that's the that's the joy of streaming, right? Where it's like it's nice when things don't work out exactly how you're expecting. Because when they do, it's boring, right? Okay. So the question is, right? Like, if I come over here. And I do Mugen. She has 59. So is that 73 towards the MP or the HP? Die. Good to test it out now. Towards the MP. But it still does combat level XP for her. I meant HP, not XP. I said previously. Okay. And then I'll have him do first aid to get the level to fully heal. She can come up here with vine grabs and then just kill you because let's not make this take any longer. And 54, level. Good. Great. That was a great fight. That was wonderful. Okay. Um. Uh. No, I haven't. Let's talk to her. Let's talk. Let's talk to Genie Girl. Did you, do you know why I'm called the Sky Witch? You're always floating. You tell the wind what to do. You really like the sky? You're always floating. Oh yeah, huh. I'm always riding this magic carpet. I guess that kind of makes sense. Okay, so let's save that. Uh, I, I can go for one more. One more, one more map. Holy Statue at Parnas. Chapter 17, A Hero's Awakening. It's so quiet. I feel lonely. All alone out here. Why do I keep thinking about him? I can fight alone. I must fight alone. I will protect the planet alone. You will die alone! Oh no. You will die alone. <laughs> the Steel Witch? What are you doing here? I pursued your party. You are alone because you foolishly left the party. It is a simple matter to kill a single witch. Die. Don't underestimate me. I'm strong enough to fight on my own. Oh no. Please tell me they leveled her up. Because I got like quite a few levels between when she between when she left and now. Lucia, where are you? Cool, cool. I can't find her yet. Hmm? Isn't that Lady Claire? You're right, it is Lady Claire. 
What's the matter, Claire? I was worried because I felt Alf and Lucia separating. Uh. Hey, Claire. Where's Lucia? I sense Lucia is in the forest nearby. That must be the forest with the holy statue of Saint Zahal. People go there to pray to the statue. Why is Lucia there? Maybe she went to get the Thunder Lepistier. I sense Lucia and the Thunder Lepistier are near each other. The Thunder Lepistier? Claire, why didn't you tell us sooner? Step on it, guys! Lucia's in trouble! Hang in there, Lucia! Um, what's going on, everyone? Did I say something wrong? I'll tell you later! We gotta save Lucia first! We gotta cheese it. Oh, wait, there's a shop here? What? Uh, excuse me. Um, yeah, buy that. Okay, so this is presumably the one for Lucia, so I'll just buy that now. Um, so yeah, yeah I'll buy that for her. No, he doesn't need it. Um, I only use her when it's absolutely mandatory. Um, I bought her last thing, so I don't think I really need to buy a better one. Wow, they have three out of them on a charm book. Um, I'm guessing that's for Thunder. Okay, so outfit. So, has a Kiri. So, less magic, but pure attack. I don't use her magic all that often. Magic good. Okay. Like to see it. Nope. Come on. Here we go. Weapon. Cheezeru. Palm. Okay. Oh, yeah. Outfit. Um, Andre Air. 70 to 110. Yeah, I'll take that. No one else uses that armor, but that's lower, that's higher. I don't really need it. Mink coat. It's uh, by two. Accessories, gold, silence, thin, speed eight, tech eight. Ooh, okay. Magic 8, Resist 8, Guard 8, Attack 8, Duty Belt 75, MP. Damn, okay, those are pretty darn good. Expensive, but will probably be worth it overall. Especially those HP plus 75, like, that's like a full hit in some cases. Um, honestly, I'll buy a yellow rock. Um, because, being honest, instead of attack up, I would rather him have more MP so he can use Magnum more times. silk coats or one of the mink coats for when I get uh, Lucia back I embrace attack goes up um, don't know who I'd want that I'll put that on her you know I'll put firing on her because she probably takes bonus damage from fire And speak with Cecile. Alf, let's hurry. I have a bad feeling about this. Me too. I feel Lucia needs help. Let's go, everyone. Speak with Claire. Why does everyone look so serious? Lady Claire, we don't have time to explain right now. Lucia's in grave peril. What? I is that so? Then we must hurry. Let's go. Literally, everyone was like, stop talking. We gotta go. The Thunder Lepistier. We might be engaging in a battle. I know we're in a hurry, but we must be prepared for what lies ahead. Got it! Return to the map. One, and official save. Before I do it, save state one. Okay. Enter the area, and then advance the story.
experiment? How can you be stronger than I am? I told you, killing a single witch is simple. I mean, she does have a Lapistier on her, so. Prepare to be exterminated. No! I am strong enough! By myself! Lucia! Uh, Al? Are you alright? Yeah, fine. How did you find me? I mean, you know, we're connected spiritually. I'm sorry for leaving you. I was shocked about Sir Heath and, and lost control of myself. Uh, I'm sorry, Lucia. It's okay. Let's go back to the hut and talk about it. Saying thank you, my rim, has the same, like, feel as any time in Three Houses Edelgard says, my teacher. When everybody else calls your character professor. <laughs> oh my god. Alf, close your eyes. Okay. Oh my god. I can see you. Really? That's impressive. Our eyes are closed. Weird. Try smiling for once, Lucia. Hey. Shut up. A smile when I feel like it. Oh my god, we got a spiritual link going on. Let's work together. Of course. It's nice of the uh, Steel Witch to just kind of let this go on. Our planet, give us power. Captain Planet. I will fight for the planet. I'll, I'll fight to protect Lucia. Alf is now a Rim Hero! And he has new armor as well. Alf? He has awoken. Oh my god. Alf's dragon power has been realized. What? Dragon power. Our stones are shining. The symbols of our brotherhood. Oh, that light. Is that... Theo, this is yours. Uh huh? Mine's shining too. Weird. What? The two stones became one. Oh my god. I I feel energy flowing into me. Oh my god, I'm going super shan. Alf, fight with me. This power is for you, Lucia. Yeah. Alf and Lucia learned a shining ray. Yo. Oh gosh, she's level 29. I wish they would, like, just give me levels. Uh, you, 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 um, you, you. Honest, what well, I actually do, what do you use? Sturm, attack down, magic down, drain, rest down. Ooh, so she, she's a debuffer. As, she's a buffer. Um, because if I could do like attack down on people, that'd be pretty awesome. But she also goes a lot, so you know, I'll use her instead, and she's lower level. Okay, DS swap. Need to remember, I can't remember last time I did that, so I think all of last fight I was freaking Reporting. messed up again. Um, okay, look at you guys. And, oh god, there are... Okay. First things first, we need to reconvene our units as quickly as possible. Um, because freaking that uh, cannot be the case. Here I go! Um, okay. Action magic... Speed up. Yeah. No problem. Okay. Let's see your best. Magic. 
Magic, Vine Grab. Okay, these guys have good resist, but I get whatever damage I can out of it. This... Oh, okay, so it's like a synergy. Okay. Alpha Lucia combo when within three squares. Okay, interesting. So... Rim here. I wonder if we got any, like, stat boosts because of it. Rim shield cancels... The next three physical attacks on target? Yo, that is awesome. That's a, that's actually a game changer. If we're being real here. Because, like... That means, oh, if someone's just, like, in deep shit, I can just be like, no, you got three hits to get out of said shit. Here I come. Uh, shine. Light wave. Nine. There we go. Twenty six. Level up. Level thirty. Okay, that's good. You're gonna heal yourself. Yeah, that was expected. Here I come. Attack Oh god, hit her from a while away. Oh god. Let's see your best. Sucked. Uh, okay, so uh, advance the story. 
Okay, so that one's kind of annoying because you have to... So I don't think I had the wrong idea of getting them close quickly, but the issue, I'd say in that case, was... Was the fact that um, you know, I'll take Cecile because she's she's just another healer. The the problem was that it just took too long. You need to get damage in immediately. I think that's the proper choice, just to make it so she doesn't um, focus on uh, healing one of the knights. Okay. Yeah, that way she'll heal herself. Everything about him changed. Still don't exactly comprehend how to do that. take out units. Uh, you... Come on. Damn. Nice way. Okay. 
It's actually pretty good, because then I can come out over here and use Shine. Wait, am I on Shine? Shine. There we go. Kill X. Get the kill XP on Lucia, which would be good. 78. Yep, level up. Good, good, good. She's using her... Wait, what the fuck? What is the range on her? Okay. Interesting. Okay. Seventy-four. Honestly, it might not be bad for me to take her... Resist up, not necessarily guard, but better to better to take care of it. Uh, oh, I guess I did cure. Yeah, other one. Oh well. so far away to even use Magnum. <laughs> it's honestly kind of throws me off. Let's pop you. Get her out of here. Because she's the one that did massive AOA. Uh, so it's better to focus on her. There we go. Heal you guys up. Oh. 
punch. Uh, rim cure. Heals HP and cure status using. Okay. Okay, so how the fuck do I do it? Skill. Whatever, I'll just keep using Magnum. Working me pretty well right now. So. It's working, why change it? people that are low on health, so... This fight, not too bad once you take out the main witch. Right? Once once you group your guys up, it's all fine. Now, the first time through was kind of annoying. I didn't I didn't expedite the process nearly as much as I should have. That was on me. I'm not gonna I'm not going to try to not take credit for that. My mistake. level. Yes, good. And then you come over here. Action, magic, heal. Heal you up. Get the XP level. Gotta make sure I get... Ooh, flash drive available. Nice. Nice. Uh, you're at 84. I don't wanna... Waste the XP. Okay, so now I finally have a res skill. Good, 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 good. In case someone is unfortunate enough to meet their demise. 18. Dude, I'm just having a fucking play day with all these guys and Alf. Like, Alf is now, like, an alpha man. He, he Alf is an alpha. Oh, yeah, what is... Like photon burst? Okay, interesting. Everybody shut up. Okay. Yeah, bringing Cecily was also a good choice because having the extra heal really makes makes a big difference on it, like almost unexpectedly. There we go. Seven flash drive ninety. You bastard! You just freaking get back here already. Tech. Oops, leveled. Ugh, okay, well, you missed. At least it's still leveled. We we take those L's. Unfortunately. Damn. Oh, so close. Um. See, at least now he has something that he can use to get XP like that. Like, it's a lot. Takes a bit, but at least it's something. 
Like, it's like, oh, at least I can guarantee some amount of XP in a turn. Whereas previously, there was no such guarantee. Don't do that. Level up. Get your XP back. 36. Good. Here. Nope. No wasted turns today. Gotta be... Gotta be good. Gotta make sure that nothing you're doing is wasted. Level up where you can, because you don't know if you'll have to use them later. Like, if I just decided not to take the free XP, right? Like, it would be like, okay, well, later on, when I need to fight you again. Bitch. Just... What is your flash? Your grim blast? Okay. Yeah, we're just gonna have him do his AoE one. This is it! <laughs> Shoot the laser! Nice. Dude, I've got like three or four kills. <laughs> Maybe more. In that. He, like, he got strong. I mean, it also helped that I gave him a whole bunch of, um whole bunch of MP, but, like, yeah. Okay, let's, uh, I want to talk to Lucia. Um, there we go. This is impossible. No, it's not. We're strong. Uh. We're big strong. Thanks, Al. You don't have to thank me. Protecting you is my duty. And my pleasure. Protect me from now on? Yes. Of course. I'll protect you forever. <laughs> Thank you. Wonderful. Wunderbar. Lucia has finally found her fated kinship. <laughs> Master once told me. Once a fated kinship has been found, protecting that bond will give them both strength. Yes. Get big swole from Bonds! Ah, this is so touching! Indeed. <laughs> yes. <laughs> A tear comes to my eye. I have killed it. <laughs> A rim, huh? <laughs> Those two are a good match. Yep. This battle has just begun. So does that mean Theo could also be one of the witch's rims? Because he's also a dragon? Ooh, don't say that, Saki. By the way, Lady Claire, about this stone. I was wondering about that light that it emitted. It must be the light Lapistier. Yo! Light Lapistier? And it was just broken. The light Lapistier was shattered into two pieces. Usually shattered is used to say many, many pieces, not shattered into two. Usually I'd say it was broke into two. And you two brothers were holding on to them this whole time. And no one knew. This, this must be destiny. Oh my god, destiny? Lucia, you should hold on to this. Your magical power will be stronger if you keep it with you. Yeah. Nah, you keep it. It's the proof of your brotherhood with Theo, right? Thank you. I'll keep it then. Good. Come on. No, give it to her. Get it strong. We'll be hunted down by the church if we stay here. Let's return to the witch village. That's a good idea. Come with us, Kai. I'm grateful. Hey, you two. Stop making eyes at each other and skedaddle. <laughs> I'm grateful. If you didn't tell me, I, I don't know what I would have done. <laughs> You gotta appreciate that Kai literally came in, saved us, and has yet to say anything. Right? Like, haven't talked to him, haven't done anything with him, he hasn't contributed, like, any real ideas. He's just came in and was like, I guess I'm part of this group now. <laughs> I'm cool sword guy. By the way, Claire? Yes? Is Mother Lapis still in Leith Forest? Yes, she's still protected by the barriers surrounding Leith Forest. Leith Forest. What's the matter, Cecile? Hmm? 
Uh, I was nervous about going there. I don't really know why. Cecile. We should move Mother Lapis to the Witch Village. It's too dangerous to leave her in the Leith Forest. I agree. I'll write a Rooney! Let's vamoose to the Leith Forest! Yay! I can't believe Iris was defeated! I underestimated the witches! Wake up, Iris! I know you have enough energy to come back to me! Of course, I cannot die. As long as you keep the Thunder Lupistier within your body, yes. Now hurry up and repair the damage you have taken. There are still many tasks I need you to accomplish. Those witches, I will exterminate them all. Exterminate. Intermission. Nice work, Alf. What, not expecting a compliment? Do you really think that I'm that cold of a person, Alf? Actually, you've just got your own way. You're a bit cold sometimes. You've just got your own way. Thanks. Most people don't realize that I just express myself differently. Yeah! Sundre! I felt cold and woke up this morning. I was disturbed to find I was on top of a cutting board. <laughs> okay, so before anything, let's be going back to the forest. Save over that. Good. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Now I'm just gonna load. Um, yeah, so this is where I'm gonna end the stream. Um, that's why I did all the saves and load state, or save state there, because I, I wanted to know if I was gonna get an encounter. Um, but yeah, so that was a good stream. Uh, didn't make as much progress as I was expecting to due to the annoying fight right at the start taking a lot longer, and then the bullcrap with uh, Heath, but we made it through a few chapters and quite a few fights. So I, I, I consider that a win. Um, so thank you all for joining me. Thank you, Fontano, Mannix. Um, let's see who else dropped by today. Uh, Fontano, Mannix. Thank you, Dodo, for dropping by. It was nice talking to you. Um, hope you all have a very nice night tomorrow, because today's Sunday. I will be back with some more East Origin. Um, if I am two-thirds of the way through the Unica route, that means I should probably be finishing her route tomorrow, um, depending on how everything goes. So look forward to that, potentially. And then on Wednesday, I will uh, play um, the next route after that. Um, and uh, I'm not going to be streaming on Friday, so... Um, either I'll do, what, what I'm thinking is I'll do is I'll do a Thursday stream instead. Um, because, uh, while I would say I would do another Sunday stream, uh, I do still plan to do a Saturday stream, a regular one of those. And doing a stream on Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, uh, that's when it really starts to wear on you. <laughs> Not in, like, a bad way, necessarily. But having, usually having the days in between streams really lets me kind of get my energy back and actually be some level of entertaining. <laughs> Although, not exactly sure how entertaining I was today, uh, given the uh, level of salt and silence just focusing and being like, okay, get this level, get this level, okay, do this here, to repeat this, rinse, re uh, wash, rinse, and repeat, basically, on it. But regardless... Um, that's the plan, uh, to do stream tomorrow, stream on Wednesday, stream Thursday, then stream on Saturday. So I hope you all have a very nice night, and will join me then. Bye!